right <laughs> back again had a bit of a nap i barbecued myself some mutton chops they were very tasty i thought why not have a go at doing this expedition give me a little break from diablo get back to a little bit of no man's sky apparently there was loads of bugs in it hopefully most of that's fixed now we can start a new game Community Expedition Singularity. Now, I haven't really paid any attention. I've kept myself well in the dark. So we're going in blind. Before I start, let me just adjust my music, because on my end it's a bit loud. Can't hear myself think. Hopefully it's okay your end, but we'll have to wait till there's somebody that can tell me. So, let's go. Community expedition time. I clicked it and nothing is happening. There we go. Singularity, eh? I've got no clue. I know it's supposed to be some arcing storyline or so. I don't know that really. I'm just not such a huge lore person, so I don't really follow that whole thing along too much. Let's see if we can work out what's what. Hey, Michal, how you doing, buddy? You know, just get a sound check and a music level check, mic check level check, because it always gets a bit wacky when I switch between games. I've, I've reduced the sound slightly on the music, but I don't know if it's I've overcooked it or... I need to buff it up at all, or is it okay? Right. Initialize expedition. Let's go. I see stars. Wait, I see stars. I guess that's normal. We're on a dissonant world to start with. Unusual. I have three health bars, so we're unbuffed. Birds in the sky. A pretty little fluorescent planet. What is this? Are we at some building already? Oh, sound and music sound good. Okay, thank you, Mihal. Ah, we had an outpost already. I need to get back in the swing of playing No Man's Sky normally. I've been doing such weird stuff with it lately. Expedition initialization complete. Singularity planet a high first contact. And what do we have here? And what must they do? A oh, harmonic scrap. This abandoned camp holds many mysteries. The expedition tab will show you your progress as you investigate its secrets. Complete milestones to earn rewards. Complete all the milestones in a phase for a special exclusive item. We can view the expeditions page. We can get exclusive rewards. Blah, de, blah, de, blah, de, blah. Right, that's fine. Got all of that. Expedition 10, Singularity. Select the They Hear Us milestone to explore the camp. Phase 107 milestones complete. Let's have a quick look. They hear us. Explore the abandoned camp. Reward traumatic seal. Crystallize heart. Search the camp. Venture to space. Search for clues. Assemble construct. Something we don't know. Something else we don't know. Complete a pilgrimage. Okay. Search the camp then. What do you have? Uh, attempt memory repair. Oh, we need to put glyphs in. We're probably going to find the code. One, two, three. Uh, probe damage registers. Ah. Or oh, 15 minus 4 is 11, 1, 7. 11, 1, 7. Oh. Wait. 11, 1, 7. Move cliff. I made a mistake. Don't do that. 11, 1, 
7. A faint hiss escapes the autophage's rusty shell. Smoke and data vent together lost to the wind. Dump memory contents. Rose from the dirt, a construct of pure will. Finalize download. I complete the memory dump, creating a copy of whatever data still flits around this hastily abandoned scrap. With the download complete, a section of the data is flagged by my exosuit as readable navigation coordinates. Oh, they hear us, spoke the autophage 5765. Uh, there's lots of bases here. Mm. Now, what about this multi-dolly? Harmonically sealed. Does this work? Let's have a look. Hey, it's not nine anymore. Have they fixed that? One, six, twelve. One, six, twelve. This is just a memory test, isn't it? One, six, twelve. Let's deactivate multi tool. And I suppose we might as well locate dissonance. Perhaps the ship will be of use. Do I even have a ship? This we have not yet established. Hey Coop, how are you doing? I'm having a little break from Diablo. Although I had a huge download for No Man's Sky because I obviously haven't updated for a while. So I did two Nightmare Dungeons whilst I waited it for it to upload. Uh, for download. <laughs> I wasn't expecting to do. Grind the progress whenever I can. Although we've discovered my character is too squishy in Diablo because I got murked in a level 70 capstone dungeon. Albeit I was only level 58 or so. But hey what, I got a load of XP though. For trying. Why am I scanning birds? I can't help myself. I can't help myself. But firstly, I don't suppose you're any good, are you? An A class, eh? Wait, we can take that, can't we? I will take it for free. Yes I will. Why hello. We have a multi-tool. I might as well grab all the scraps. And I should probably look about what we're actually supposed to be doing. Tainted metal, eh? Grab the rest of this stuff. Alright, let's have a quick check. So, we have barely any resources. For some reason we got a save beacon. Okay. We have a personal refiner. Let's make some ferrite dust. I have no fuel. Okay. Starship? We have a solar ship. Does everybody start with a solar ship? Mihao seems to suggest so. And we have a multi-tool. With a mining beam. That is buffed. Wait. We have a charge slot. Let's put it in a buffed slot. Wait, that's the wrong one. Put this one in the buff stop. I don't know if that works. Guess we'll find out. Right. Yellow. What is yellow? Yellow is a save beacon. That seems like somebody else's stuff. There is a crash ship 23 minutes away. Now, if I was feeling mad, I'd walk to that and go pick it up. But I don't know that I'm feeling that mad today. You had a little Diablo break this morning, but back with work now. Uh, work has got to happen, hasn't it? Alas, we all have to eat. Why is there save beacons everywhere? And there's bases everywhere. Well, let's have a look. What are we actually supposed to be doing? Well, you can collect a reward already. Amatic seal and crystallized heart. Looks like the most useful of things, but perhaps we will need it. What else? 
Venture into space is my next objective. That's all I know. Launch to space. The sentience echo coordinates require starship travel. Locate and repair your starship. Ah, my starship, eh? Four minutes away. A hefty jump. Oh dear, we are flying. Glorious. Do I have a jetpack? Do I have a shield? Am I going to one-shot myself? Oof. I look at that. I spot a Sula ship. How long is the expedition up for? I think it's usually about four weeks or so. So try and fit it in somewhere, just so that you don't miss out. I don't actually know what the rewards are. I'm completely blind. I have no idea. But I've done every expedition till now, so we're not going to miss one week. Probably I should mine this. I can't mine this. Probably I should mine carbon. Are you carbon? Oh my god, it takes so long just to mine this little diddly plant. 59 carbon. I'll dig it. You also look like carbon. I'll take more carbon. So I can charge my mining beam. And let's get some ferret dust. I should probably scan all of these so we get the secondary. Hey, Douglas Pine, how are you doing? There's a little bit of expedition action going on. I'm blind. I have no idea what's going to happen. I've kept myself unspoiled. I don't even know what the rewards are. I'm going to find out. Have a pleasant surprise. Oxygen. I'll take oxygen. And given we're on a dissonant planet, I wonder if we're supposed to be collecting dissonant. Ooh, oxygen. More oxygen. I'm getting to repair the ship, probably, aren't I? <gasps> oh, God. I'm out of jetpack. Trying carefully not to just kill myself. Not a bad planet, actually, is it? Keep getting ferrite dust. Are we going to need pure ferrite and stuff? Maybe. Game on, indeed. I suppose most people have probably done the expedition already. Not everybody. Me and Coop haven't done it yet. <laughs> Although, I did hear there was a load of bugs that hopefully they've ironed out now. There's always the slight benefit of waiting for them to deal with the immediate bugs. Uh, ever present on a No Man's Sky update. Part of parcel of this game. One of the quests is purple dust. Yes, I expected so. I haven't really got any yet, have I? I can grab some as we go. Who knows how much of this stuff we're going to need. If I was mad, I'd probably try and do the expedition hudless, but given that it's constant quests and probably get boring very quickly my last foray into No Man's Sky we'd had a Hudless Pirate Adventuring which was a lot of fun but those saves are kind of retired now uh, what am I doing? I was going to my ship and then I have kind of got distracted Let's go see what we need to do to actually repair it. Great dust. Unidentified blunt. Let's scan you. You've only done the first bit. Tons of bugs are gone. Good to know. See, sometimes it plays not to be an early adopter. Indeed. Although I must say, most of the time I'm straight on it. It's just I happen to be 
very deep inside living my Diablo life I, I do find it slightly difficult to focus on more than one game at a time I don't know how multi-content people do it to be honest because I get into a game I just want to play it and if I don't get into a game then I'm not into it then I don't want to play it so it swings in roundabouts right it's unusual for a ship to be at a building but it is I wonder if we should be getting salvage data there's no damaged machinery here eh let us heal right we have the buzzerton of souls what do we need to do to actually repair this bad boy is it normal resources? Looks like it is normal resources. So, I have none of this stuff. Uh, we've been collecting. I haven't really collected the right stuff. Although, we have a personal refiner. So we can charge up this bad boy. Let's get rid of that. Let's see. It's make some condensed carbon oh god it feels good to be on a normal save where we get loads of resources and can refine infinitely it feels like i'm playing with hacks it really does <laughs> wasn't that easy what else do we need we're gonna need pure ferrite let's make some pure ferrite we're gonna want to have a medic seal a metal plating Dihydrogen jelly. Now, was that right? This, 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 and this. Well, hello. I didn't really just get my pure ferret directly from. Where did this come from? I must have mined this. Right, we have a ship repaired. Is that all I had to do? I need to sort out my hotkeys. I like this to be on number four. And I like photo mode to be on number three. I like summon ship to be... Oh, I can't do it because I'm on the ground. Before we do anything, let's go check out the dissonance. Because perhaps I want another ship. Who knows? Is there any world in which I do not want another ship? Even if it's just to sell it, it's probably good, isn't it? It's a worthy distraction, perhaps. Bases everywhere. Gile Sky's base. Do we go have a look at someone's base? I wonder if the ship is any good in this place. How many people went to get a ship? I mean... Probably the vast majority of people went to get the ship, didn't they? Isn't that the first thing people go and do? Why, hello ship! A C-Class, eh? 57 million units worth, eh? I will take this Hylian Brain and this Savage Class and this Pugnum. Wait! I don't have an advanced mining laser. Mistakes were made! Wait, can I cheese it? Maybe I can cheese it. There's no boxes here to cheese it with. Cheese it? Uh, do that. And cheese it. No, it didn't work. Why did it not work? Is it because I already took the stuff out? Maybe. I've forgotten how to cheese it. Try again. I'm wasting my Atlantidium. I don't even know how to say that word. This didn't work. This is not cheesable. Okay, never mind. Wait, before I do anything, did my original multi tool happen to have an advanced mining laser? Nope, I want.
regular mining laser. Let's have a terrain manipulator. I want that. Right, let's switch back. And then install this. Good. And I don't have an advanced mining laser, so we can't actually get this shit. Dang it. There's not another way to get radiant shards, is there? Okay. Food for thought for another day. So what am I actually supposed to do? Venture into space. We can do that. I barely have any resources. I don't even have any launch fuel. We're not particularly prepared. Let's go find out what we're actually supposed to do. Euclid Galaxy discovered by Hello Games, eh? Right, what have we got? The Wayfarer made your way to the stars. What's my reward? Warp Piper Cure times three pre-packaged teleport receiver. Okay. We have warp capabilities. Good to know. And we have a teleport receiver. Also good to know. What do we do next? Search for clues. Current objective. Follow the sentience echo's coordinates. Okay. Deploy the scanner. Sentience echo trace reharmonized. So many icons here. Where is it? Move uh, there. Reach the area. Okay, let's go have a look. Cheese mode was removed. Ah, very clever. They fixed the cheese. Ah, I think that's a good thing. Seems a bit silly to have cheesy tactics to skip all the difficult grind. a nice looking ship we've got. Does everybody start with the same ship? This is like a beeble bum colours. Black and yellow. Not bad. Right. What do we have to do here then? We go for a spin. New planetary record most toxic. Given it's my first toxic planet, I suppose that shouldn't be unexpected. And I guess we're going to have to search for locations. It's going to be that big building we just flew over, isn't it? Yeah, of course it is. Of course it is. Is it you? Target aligned. You cheesy. Oh no, I have no fuel. I forgot about that. Ow. Who? I shouldn't have landed yet. I have to make some launch fuel. Uh, my hydrogen. Let's go make launch fuel before I lose my ship. I'm not sure this mining beam is buffed in this buffed slot, by the way. It doesn't feel very strong. What was cheese mode? There used to be a way that you could collect the ship without having to do the quest of... There was a little bug where you could skip the screen. But they fixed it, so you can't do it anymore. So it doesn't matter. But it would have mean I could have gotten that ship straight away, even though I don't have an advanced mining laser. I wouldn't have to do all the questing and collecting radiant shards and going to monoliths and all that. Did I get enough? I need 40. We have enough. Let us make one launch ship fuel. Let us charge our ship. Technology 
and let us be lazy and fly over <laughs> because we can and there's a free landing so we might as well I'm assuming this is the place we're supposed to go might be wrong Reach the marked area and perform further investigations. Uh, oh, God. 80. There we go. Do I have any money? Pretty broke. Can I sell anything? I could sell the Highland Brain. Maybe I could buy some launch fuel if we're lucky. Oh god, it's so expensive. Nothing else. Sell. I will sell rusted metal. I will sell salvage... No, I bet not sell salvage glass. I will sell pugnum. I will sell... Hylimbrin. I will sell fluids. I will sell tainted metal. And I will sell... We need this later. I won't sell this. I will sell... We might need this as well. Uh, I better not sell that. I've got 87,000. I will buy all the fairy dust. I'll buy all the cobalt. I will buy new metal platings. I will buy one expensive launch fuel, but it's precious and I want it. We're done shopping. Let's go find out what we're supposed to do. Remember Expedition Rule 1. Always collect rewards as they often help next bit. Did I collect the rewards? I collected the rewards, didn't I? I did. One blueprint from an infinite... Wait, wait, wait. One blueprint from an infinite number. One blueprint from all the ways to be. One construct. Extract the blueprint. I copy the blueprint. A blueprint from the archives data banks. Whoever left the message at the autophage wished for someone to find this. This construct. Oh my god, what the hell is that? Construct head. Salvaged autophage component. The circuit cage and primary control centers for a primitive automation. Plans for this unit were extracted from an autophage left at an abandoned junkers camp. We need batteries, plating, and microprocessors. Okay. And we probably get some reward now. You're not going to give me batteries by any chance, eh? Wait, what was the reward? Nanites! Band hazard protection model. Okay. I will put that in my buff slot for lots of hazard protection. But that's not true. I don't even want that. I want movement for lots of buffed movement. Wait, that might not work. Oh god, that's terrible. Oh well, that will do. Right, what's it wanting here? It's wanting construct head. They need batteries. I need microprocessor. She needs chromatic metal and carbon nanotubule. Or I could go try find one. Or I could see if they're for sale. They are for sale. 27,000 units, eh? I need money. Where, oh, where do we get some money? Mm, I don't need much money. Is there anything that I could sell? Ah, I know. Let's go murder some creatures and sell some meat. Don't tell anybody this sneaky little trick for making money. So there's no creatures here. How am I supposed to butcher? Are you kidding me? Scan. Scan makes... Wait, there's a red dot. What the hell are you? Your meat. I need you. Sorry, buddy. 
Oh god. Oh god. He's actually charging at me. Meaty chunks. We're going to sell meaty chunks. And get... Wait, I can't mind. Wait. Wait, hello. You're not meaty chunks. You're... Strider meat? Even more Strider sausage. Very lucrative. Wait, I pissed off somebody. I've lost them. Wait, hello meaty chunks. <laughs> Come back here. Wait, he's escaping. This isn't right. I'm the apex predator on this planet. My mining beam. Oh, I'll, I'll let the baby live. I'm not cruel. I'm not cruel. Live and let live. How much money do we have so far? 16,000. That's not enough yet, is it? <laughs> I need more meat. Let's die hydrogen whilst we're walking by. Wait, give me a storm crystal. That would sort save my money woes. One storm crystal, please. <gasps> crystal fragment. We have a lucky chance. One time. One time. No. No. Damn it. Uh, why, hello, meat. God, you're so strong. Why, hello, earwig meat. Nobody's going to eat this thing, is there? Please insta-die. Scooped innards. Very, very tasty. Ooh, look. This is better money. I'll just dig for damage machinery. That'll sort me out. Why am I murdering creatures when I could just dig for buried modules? We got two lots. We got twins here. Right, so... Well, hello, buried tech. Right, just a second. Right, sorry that about that. Right, surely we have enough money now. We are rich. And we've got a crap ton of oxygen. I will take every one. Leveling up. Do we still murder cows for meat? Yes. I have no bullets. Wait. I can make bullets. Sorry, cows. We leveled up. Whoop. Plenty of meat. Way better. Who thought a bot caster would be better than a mining beam, eh? Oh, I one-shot him. Not bad. Run! Right, I think we've got enough money now. Let's go get ourselves a microprocessor. <laughs> Not cool, just leave it an orphan. <laughs> oh. I like this song. It was... Oh god, I just used up my iron battery. Idiot. Do I have enough to make more? Please? I do. We need some jetpack upgrades. Right. Let's go sell the meat. 
Sell the savage datas. Make ourselves some money. Also, do you have anything that's useful? You know, we don't have any nanites. I do have some nanites. Well, hello. Apparently, I have most of this stuff anyway. Right, we sell the sausage. The steak. Eaty chunks and innards. <coughs> oh, excuse me. I have a dry throat today. I will have a microprocessor. And we have a construct head. Eyes to see crafted the construct's head. Okay, what next? Let's get our reward. Supreme scanning system upgrade and a Prepackaged advanced mining laser. Well, look at that. Yes, please. Also, yes, please. Right. What's next on the agenda? Let's have a look. Current objective, present the construct to the Atlas. Okay. Is it gonna show me where the Atlas is or are we gonna to have to find out our own way? Also, where did I park? Let's go. Now, technically, I could go back and get the dissonant ship. But I don't need to do that. Let's just keep going. Wait, what if I do need to do that? It solves money problems, doesn't it? Wait. Nexus. Can't I just get my rewards and have a ship anyway if I really want one not at the moment anyway I presume I need to walk now do I what does it say when in space access the galaxy map mission path locate act okay let's have a look all the way over here eh out of jump range Can I get any closer? Oh god, my jump range is pathetic. Okay, 99 light years at a time. Did I sell the brain? Oh, damn it. Idiot. <laughs> well, needs must. We needed the money. Although I could have just killed a few more sausages. Thankfully, we can do a few jumps. Get straight there. I wonder if I should have gone to the space stations and done more shopping. We could do with getting some uranium. Oh god. I don't want a pirate battle. Avoid! Detour. Leave me alone! Dodge all bullets. Oh, they got me. Right. I didn't actually sell my salvage data, did I? Let's open this, actually. Upgrade? Gold. Gold, eh? I don't mind if I do. We can sell gold for even more money. Anything else I could refine? Not really. 
I have 430 nanites. My best upgrade is movement. Can I afford a slot? Did I just get a slot for free? I, I think we just got a slot for free. I, is that because it was my first slot? That's not normally free, is it? 600 nanites, eh? Movement class C. I'm desperate. I'll dig it. Anything else I'm desperate for? I'm in normal mode. Who needs protection? Movement. I'm desperate. I'll have a C class. It's amazing. I'll buff it. Surely it's worse than that B. Actually, this is actually even worse. Right. What else? Shop. Please have some uranium. This is all I want. No. Let me make the rest of my money. And gold. And service status. We have 400,000. I will buy ferret dust. Cobalt. I'll buy a few carbon nanotubules. Will I need more microprocessors? They're fairly pricey, aren't they? I just sold the gold. Nope, that's all I want. You can choose it by going to the anomaly, change ship to the intercept and portal to the station. It will get repaired. Wait, what? I don't actually have it yet though. Yeah, that's true. I can't remember that. It used to be that you could claim your anomaly rewards, even in expeditions. In which case, you've got a free ship anyway. <gasps> Uranium! Why, hello, I will take all of you, you precious resource, you. I'll also take pure ferrite. I will also... cheese the game by refining five magnet golds and making money instantly by making oh my god it's normal mode it's glorious it stacks up infinitely and we make a profit by selling the gold wait we didn't make a profit why not wait have they changed it they must have changed it did i make a profit I made a loss. Surely I made a loss then. How much did they cost? I think we made a loss. I bought five of them. I have less than five of them. They've changed it. Damn it. Oh well. That's how I used to make money back in the day. Right. We have a bit of fuel. Onwards to the Atlas station. Let me escape the free to battle. Yeah, you used to be able to refine Magna Gold, and it would have more gold in it than what the Magna Gold cost. So you just refine them and you'd make a profit. Why, hello, Atlas Station. I made some AI art for my screenshot and I used the Atlas as an inspiration and it's come up with quite a cool little picture. Atlas inspired. Should be on the thumbnail. I thought it was kind of interesting. It's been a while since I've been in Atlas actually. I never go in these things anymore. I need to put something in here that kind of makes you go in because it is quite nice to come inside. I used to learn loads of words. I presume that's still the case. Did I learn a word? 
Wait, it's not telling me words. Have they changed it? Maybe they've changed it. You used to learn words. It's also got a new animation. I don't know what's happening. Wait, I learned a word this time. Maybe this looks different because it's the expedition. I stand before the Atlas. It is unknowable. It cannot know me. It cannot know any of this. And yet I am compelled to be here to offer it my own fledgling creation, my construct. The Atlas cannot react. It does not react. It's all noise, yet it is wordless. Its voice is the entire universe. And at the seed is revealed to me. I take my leave. Seed of dreams. 100 chromatic metal. Visited the first Atlas station. Please don't give me 200 uranium as a reward after I just bought 200 uranium. What do we get? Seed of Dreams, Warp Hypercore Plants. Okay. Wait, Warp Hypercore Plants. I didn't have any Storm Crystals or Antimatter or Chromatic Metal. Gonna have to go farming. You know, I presume we're gonna have to build this. Towards the Atlas Seed. We get units, gold nuggets, gold nuggets, and a Supreme Hyperdrive. Exosuit, storage, paralysis mortar unit, okay. Right, so I need chromatic metal, eh? Chromatic metal. I don't have any special hyperdrives. So I guess I need to go farm copper and refine it. Are there bird sounds in the music, or do you have birds? Alternatively, I'm hearing things. I think you're hearing things, Coop. <laughs> First sign of madness, hearing birds. <laughs> Mihal rescues you and says, nope, there's birds in the music. Wait, KFS gold mine. Why, I don't mind if I do. Discovered by your bank account. <laughs> that is so cool. <laughs> Discovered by your bank account, and it's a gold mine. Why, hello? Will it work? That is pretty cool. That made me laugh. Collect your free warp cores. Oh, I forgot to do that, didn't I? Oh, damn it. Too late. And I just missed the landing pad. Oh my god, I just... What, what was that? I just fell through the floor. God, and now I'm stuck. Oh my god. I'm in a hole. It's a trap. I've been trapped inside. Who built this base to trap me? Eh? I don't have any jetpack. I need my jetpack back. We have found ourselves a gold mine. Wait, gold. It doesn't refine to chromatic metal, does it? That would be too easy. Why, hello, gold mine. Storing 20,000 gold. I will take it all. Because why not? Is that everything? Storage is empty. We've taken the lot. <laughs> Not bad, not bad. What are all these bases here? What? There's so many bases and messages and everything. Can I leave a message? Can I build a message? Where will you let me build it? Please let me build a message. I will say thank you for the gold. Thanks for the gold. See check. 
Right, we are rich. I almost fell down this death trap. Right, gold. That is a lot of gold. Pirate. Pirate refines the ferret dust, doesn't it? None of that is any good. A copper. I did a copper mine. Anybody get a copper mine out here? Lying Island. Gold. Serenity. Med. That means honey in check. Alternatively, I'm going to have to do this myself, in which case I want sodium, relic, gold, sodium. Oh my god, seriously? Gold. There's gold everywhere. Where is copper? I left the warp cores at the United Station. I did. I know. I'm sorry. I forgot. Do we go back up for them? Do we need to? I probably should, shouldn't I? I wasn't thinking about it. Come on. There's got to be copper in this world somewhere. Sodium. I find it really cool that somebody made a planet called your account and then made a gold mine on it. That is so funny. Get some dihydrogen. Surely somewhere here is copper. Copper! Perfect! Do I walk? Do we fly? I don't have that much fuel. I guess we walk for now. I'll be warping lots. Yeah, well, okay, we'll go back to the Atlas station. Once we get my copper, my chromatic metal. And my very dust. Give me more fire dust. Probably scan it and get sodium as well, because why not? Didn't really get that much carbon. Right, copper. I guess I want all of this copper. Why hello, creature. Wait, I got a hundred thousand units for scanning a creature. I'm rich. Uh, I want Mennonites. Wait, I don't get my nanites. Since when is this a thing? Discovered four weeks ago by your bank account. Fair enough. He took all the thought I could normally claim as well. Have they changed it? Right, let us mine up some copper. Need a hundred for the seed. And then I need to resume some for some warp hyper cores at some point. And that's chromatic metals. We still have to refine it all. In fact, we'll just start refining. Whilst we mine, multitasking. There's a lot of copper here. Unfortunately, my mining upgrades are not brilliant. I, I have none. How much of this do I really want? I don't know. I want to stay and collect all of it. I mean, I would love to, but...
Do you think it goes faster if I move my mouse faster? Probably not. I shouldn't be able to make that yet. How deep does this go? There's a huge amount of copper here. I'm just not getting that much help from it. Right, we might as well build this thing, get a little bit more. Milestone complete, Seeds of Dreams, forged the first Atlas Seed, and then let's get our rewards. How much more of this do we need to reckon? Mad of charge. Sign to go. Where do I leave my ship actually? I see you. Let's head back to the ship. I would summon it, but we don't have much fuel, so I don't want to waste it. Also, let's get our reward. 190,000 units, golden nuggets, golden nuggets. Given that we just found a gold mine on the planet, I'm not sure we need gold nuggets, but... There you go. Oh, we got a hyperdrive module. Now that will be useful. I need a bird pet, or a beetle pet. Something that could fly me to my ship. the oxygen for the life supports right let's carry on next objective is pilgrimage one reach the first rendezvous point let's see how much warping we have to do I suppose I could see if there's any gold that's finished probably not but let's just have a quick peek Oh well. There's my jankly parked ship. Let's install my hyperdrive into the boost slot. We have a range of four, two, three. I'm presuming that it's better that way. Yes, it's better that way. We have pyrite for fuel, perfect. That's why we got the pyrite. Open this. We have sodium for pirates, oh dear. Right, I think we're good to go. Do I need anything of this? We've kind of got most of what we need, isn't it? We've got the pyrite, so I don't need tritium. I'll dig a little bit anyway. Right, onwards to the Pilgrim. How far away is it? We explore, I want mission. This way, eh? Can I go in one jump? I can go in one jump. And it's a dissonant system. I forgot to go get the warp cells. Oh well. Oh well. Stakes were made. Oh, my daughters are shouting. Don't know if you can hear that or not. 
They do have a noise gate, so it does block some stuff. But when they're loud, they're loud. Right. There's another save beacon. Let's go to the rendezvous. Ancient bones, copper, pyrite, silver. Hey, Skip. Nice to see you playing. Yes, I haven't had a go at the expedition yet. Right. Right, I'm actually being hailed by a dissonant echo. Let's have a look, see what they have to say. <laughs> what the hell is this thing? That looks impressive. Probe the structure. Uh, okay, I was n was going to read, but perhaps not. Are we supposed to make sense of that? 69, 66, 65, 69, 65, 65, 65. There's lots of 69s and 65s. If I've got to crack that code, I don't know what to do. What the hell is this thing? Am I supposed to shoot it? Fragment of New Atlantid? We what? Fragment of New Atlantid. Now, am I supposed to shoot it? Oop. Oop. Wait, I can damage it. It's not shooting back. Uh, is it going to explode and kill me? Ah, it exploded. I got a and Liddy did it. I got a radiant shard. And I think I got some of this. What was the point of that? Was I supposed to kill it? What if I've done something terrible? Rogue then kill. <laughs> uh. Right, let's head to the rendezvous and see what's what. Loads of bases again. Dragon is a useful base. To riff punk. Opulent Box. Now that has me curious. Let's go visit Opulent Box. I'm all for a little bit of opulence. There's my 9999 gold. Wait, what is this? What's going on? What just happened? Where's Opulent Box? There's too many bases here, it's confusing. I need to reline up. Some have translated the message and law. Wait, is it translatable? God, they're so... I want opulent box, I've, I've lost it. Opulent box, tag. Senor Cor Cog's base. You, the base name that's inspired me. I want to know what's opulent and if I can have it. It would be cool if you could leave people your treasures that you find. What if I could donate people my lewd literature in a box? That would be cool. Why, hello, opulent box. I will land next to you and go peek inside. Why, hello. Anybody home? Uh, there's a teleporter. Uh, there's a battery. Cannot see a thing. Is this it? Opulent box. This wall is here. It's an empty room. Opulent. This isn't opulent. Fair enough. 
Right, what were we actually supposed to do here? Go to the rendezvous point, which is five hours away. I guess let's go do that. Wait! Do I need nav datas? No. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know if we need them or not. I couldn't be bothered to waste my fuel. Right, let's go to the rendezvous. Some base is more useful than others. So many bases. Singularity Spaceport. But it's quite far away. I wonder if we're supposed to go there. What the hell? Oh, it's approximate location. Well, let's try and go to Singularity Spaceport and see if that's a more exact location. It feels quite far away, but maybe... Rendezvous. I mean, I'm not seeing anything here. Is it over the mountain? Mm, no. Okay, never mind. Let's go find it manually. I'm crash landing here. Right, let's just land and see if we can scan for it. Five, six, eight. Target aligned. Let's grab some ant. How do you even say this? Ant laddi. Wait, ant. At Atlantidium. 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 Is that a real word? Or have they made this up? Atlantidium. Atlantidium. I want more Atlantidium. Please. I want even more Atlantidium. And we're going in the right direction. Think Atlantis, yeah. Lost city of Atlantis. Is this what this is about? Ooh. Ooh, a camp. Wait, I got an advanced mining laser. Let's take a radiant shard. Who knows when it might come in handy. A mass 256 Atlantidium. I get a reward. I didn't even know. And I get this reward. Pre-packaged cloaking device. Pre-packaged cloaking device. Odd servo and a hazard protection. Don't mind if I do. I'll take it all. And I'll install hazard protection. Odd servo, I guess we keep in case we need it. And I will have a pre-packaged cloaking device. In a while since I've used it, how does one use this again? Huh. We're invisible. Perfect. I'll we'll take some sodium. I wonder if we'll need any more. Probably not, given we just pleated a nasty it some. Right, let's have a look. Why, hello. Complete the first pilgrimage. Can I leave a message? No edit. I cannot. Fair enough. I don't suppose you're an upgrade, are you? I can't even look. Do we get a dissonant ship whilst we're here? Come on. Let's scan the registry. 
22 minus 6. That's a big number. 16, 5, 11. Sixteen, five, eleven. Lift the lockdown. And let's check the multi door line up. And the scan for dissonance, because why not? Might go have a look at it, see if I like the look of it. 15 minutes away. So what class are you? And do you have an upgrade? A B class? With a plasma launcher. <gasps> I'm playing on normal mode. I can use a plasma launcher. I will take it. I never use a plasma launcher. Normal mode is for plasma launchers. Wait, what happens if you die in normal mode? Is there a problem with dying in normal mode? Do I lose it, something? Do I lose all my inventory? I don't even know what happens if you die. Do I suicide to find out? How does one use a plasma launcher? Oh god, it needs unstable plasma. I don't have any. Can I make any? Unstable plasma, I can. I can make one. I used up all my metal platings already. Right. How does one use this weapon? I literally haven't used the plasma launcher since I... Played my normal mode. How many years ago was No Man's Sky released? Eight years ago? Seven years ago? Whatever. I just want to use this weapon. Boop! <gasps> Glorious! I would shoot the floor, but that probably suicides. What can I shoot? What can I shoot? A tree. Can you kill a tree in one shot? Boop! Uh, oh my god. It goes in an arc. Boop! I missed the tree. I'm terrible with the plasma launcher. Oh, it bounced off the tree. Oh my god. Did you see that? It bounced off the tree. Oh, it bounces off the tree. No wonder people suicide themselves. I left the camp upgrades. Wait, camp upgrades? Do you mean these things? I haven't had a chance to look yet, have I? What do you mean, camp upgrades? I'm playing with my new toy. I have a plansable launcher and I'm not afraid to use it. Wait, we gotta... Pack it. <gasps> a nip-nip! We got a nip-nip! And we got a pulse bitter module, eh? None of which is particularly useful. Right, if I shoot in the cave, it literally bounces in the floor. I can't believe it bounces off trees. Does it bounce off buildings? <gasps> oh my god, it bounces off buildings! Oh my god! No wonder people suicide themselves. It literally, like, just... Do you reckon it one-shots me? It's got to one-shot me. Do I suicide to find out what happens when we die? What if I lose everything? That wouldn't be good, because then I'd lose all of this as well. Wait, I could put it all on my ship. And then test. I kind of need to know before I play around with this thing and accidentally kill myself. How does it not... Is there any way I can kill a tree? 
Because it bounces off a tree. I need it to roll up to a tree. Are you kidding? I need it to roll up to a tree. I'm killing rocks. I have no thermal protection. <gasps> I have no sodium. Oh my god. Am I actually going to kill myself? In normal mode? From a storm? This can't be happening. Let's hide in a cave. Don't use a plasma launcher. Whatever I do. Not inside a cave. What do I? I am going to try. <gasps> Run away! I think this is my new favorite weapon. Wait, if I shoot up here, it's going to roll back down on top of me. This could be a glorious moment. Run, 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 run. Ah, it explodes before it can run down the hill. Kind of funny, though. I kind of need to know what happens when I die. So that I can play around without screwing up my playthrough. Let's get my ship here. Wait, my ship hotkey. I haven't sorted it yet. I realize why you kill yourself. Because sometimes you just click with the mouse. So if you accidentally click the plasma cannon, you literally just one-shot yourself. I haven't actually done what I'm supposed to do yet, have I? I need to speak to the dude. Did I? I don't know if I spoke to him or not. I guess I must have done. Right, what am I actually supposed to do? Let's get my reward, first of all. That's what you wanted me to do. Okay. We got exosuit slots. Which I can't use yet. There's actual cargo slots. Oh, they're down here. Okay, that's confusing. What is this? Multi-tool expansion slots. Okay, okay. What is this? Repackage mortar. Perilous mortar. What do you do again? Your stun grenades. Which one is which? Wait, how do I switch between them? Cloaking device, plasma launcher, personal force field, perilous morsa. So you don't move. You're like a sticky stun grenade. Can I stun myself? I can't stun myself. Why is there smoke over here? Keep the quad servo noted. You get a grave to run to in order to collect your stuff. Okay, so it doesn't matter if I suicide myself. Right, reach the second rendezvous point. I guess we go do that. Well, let's go have a look at this other ship first. See if it's any good. A dissonant spike coordinate. Let's have a look. I haven't even decided which dissonant ships I really like yet. I like it, the little baby mini, mini ones. I guess I like the rare ones, but only because they're rare. Like, what is what is going on here? What is this ship location? Can't see a thing. Can they park anywhere? God, you look boring. And you're buried in a cliff. You are 77 million. Maybe I just steal your goodies instead. Yeah, forget it. I don't want this one. 
The robot's buried in the rock. Ten walker brains, eh? Ten? That's a lot, isn't it? It's not normally ten. Wait, is this normal mode? Do you get ten in normal mode? I bet it is. God. How much do we normally get in permadeath? We get a lot less than that. Right, we have walker brains. We have quad servos and walker brains. On to the second rendezvous point. Also, did we get a thing? We get collect reward. Atlas poster plans. Atlantic poster plans. Construct poster plans. I will take those rewards. Thank you very much. Construct poster. Very nice, very nice. And a blueprint added to my catalogue. Right, so I need to get off my... I need to abandon this one. I need to abandon this one. I need to get back onto my singularity. Complete phase two. Phase two. Complete the second pilgrimage. Tune to the glass, extract radiant shards. Oh god, I need lots of them. Assemble the second construct. Commune with the atlas. Forge the second atlas seed. And we've already done this one. Right. How far do we have to go? Do I have enough warp cells? Also, the music seems to have stopped. Let's put some music back on. Very good. Where? Oh, where? Can I go in one jump? I can. Right, so we need Radiant Shards, and lots of them. Let's do that in this dissonant system. Always 10. Good for a complex scanner, yes. Copper Radiant Shard Farm. Wait, what? Radiant Shard Farm? What's a Radiant Shard Farm? Don't mind if I do. So I don't seem to have this as my objective. We're going to a Radiant Shard Farm. How does one make a Radiant Shard Farm? Maybe they've just found a location with lots of radiant shards in one place or something. Nearby object. No. Mount Macabre. What a name. What a mount. I see a landing pad. Why Exomech? Why look at this? I take an exomech. Does that mean I have it always, or is it only on this planet? I will summon the exomech. No. Yes. Why, hello, Minotaur. Perfect. Glorious. But I don't want it right now. I don't normally use this thing, I have to say. What is a radiant shard farm? There's a glitching separator. There's a fire. There's a save point. Oh my god. Wait, is this a buildable object? Have they given us this to build? I don't remember that. Is that new? That must be new. But that's not farmable. I've been duped. It's not a radiant shard farm. It also said it was a copper mine. Just a little base. Right, so where is the rendezvous point? 18 minutes away. I suppose I should fly there. Grave of Zahak. Oh my god, that's a boring name. I can't even read it.
It's nice seeing all these bases. Wait, that's the gradient shard. I just went to the wrong base. Naughty Aki's base. Okay, not only does it say radiant shard, it also has a name that says Naughty Aki. If that doesn't make you want to go visit, I don't know what will. What a name, Naughty Aki. Well, hello, Naughty Aki. Do you have radiant shards here? I, th I think you do. I need radiant shards. Why, hello. One radiant shard. Two radiant shards. Three radiant shards. Oh. Not a bad location. I like this idea. A radiant shard base. Five. Very good. And there's copper too. Why, look at that. 64,000 copper. I think we've got enough copper, boys. Which means we've got chromatic metal. Oh my god. It lets me, refi it lets me refine all of it. This is broken. I can normally like refine like a hundred of this. If that. It's probably a lie. I can probably do 250. But you know what I mean. Why, look at this, a teleporter. Why, where do you go? L wait, more? More shards. Is there more shards? Oh my god, is there a shard loop? Was it taking me inside? No! You did the base wrong. You should have a teleporter to more shards. And then another teleporter to even more shards. And then another teleporter to even more shards. Message module, let's say hello. You find the message from the owner. What's the message? Is it... It didn't work. It did not work. Isn't this supposed to... He's left a message module with no message in. I don't have any hazmat gloves. Object in use? What? Something's broken. Object in use. I'm so used to perma, normal is broken for me. I know, it does feel very broken, doesn't it? Oh my god, my refine is still going. I mean, look at this. This is madness. I can literally just refine the whole of it. 22 minutes and I'll have 4,000 chromatic metal. Broken, I tell you. Let's get rid of this junk. He missed a trick here, though. He, what he needed to do was to build this thing... And then link more teleport to go get more radiant shards. That would have been very cool. Right, I might as well wander around and get the rest of my radiant shards. We need 16. I have 7. We're almost halfway there. <gasps> oh my god, there's a Gekling. Why, hello. Uh, Corrupt Sentinel. Where'd they go? What the hell is that? Oh my god! Someone's literally bought a build a base in the sky! What is that pole? I don't remember that pole. What base is this? What base part is this? Is that a new base part? I want to go to the top of that thing! Is there a landing pad up there? Fascinating seeing other people's random bases. What the hell is this? Well, hello, Gek. Is this just like... That's his base still. I, it's so high up I cannot even see it. Let's go to the top. Didn't realize you could build so high. Please have a landing pad. Why, hello. Hmm. 
Not bad, not bad. There's also a kill X number of corrupt sentinels. Ah, so I should have been murking him. Fair enough. Why, hello! I'm impressed with your base. Now, this is the deluxe suite for the elite clientele, where there is Nip Nip on site, but it needs hazmats, and we don't have any hazmats. Oh, look at this. He's been shrinking five places. Once upon a time, I knew how to do that, although I probably have forgotten. He's also shrunk these things. That looks very cool. That looks really cool. I like this. This is very extravagant and elegant. Perfect little bar. Even got a microwave out back. Not bad, not bad. And what is this? A bed. A sleeping mat. Why, hello. Might as well have a little cozy sit down. Chill for a little minute. Look at all these lightings. Impressive. Little mini lights everywhere. For the extraordinarily glaring delt. Where these stairs that go down in a sec. Wait, where are we going here? This is a secret location. Is that a teleport? That is a teleport. Huh? Where did I teleport to? Did I teleport? Uh, we it teleports. <laughs> it teleports me here. Really? I'm so confused. Where the hell am I? I mean, you know what we have to do, don't you? We have to jump. Why, hello! Oh, God. Oh, God! Oh, God! Wait, can I get to that? <gasps> Wait, I fell through it! Damn it. Oh, God, I've got no jetpack. I've got no jetpack. I've got no jetpack. Splat, kasplat, kasplat. <gasps> Emergency jetpack. Ooh. Very nice. What a cool base. Why, hello, Corrupt Sentinel. I have a bolt caster. No. I have a... What you call it? I have a... Plasma launcher. There's no way I can hit him, is there? Is there a way I can hit him? What do you reckon? Aim slightly above his head. Slightly above. Slightly above. Boop. Come on. No, it missed you. Boop. Oh, God, that's terrible. What if I direct hit him? No. Way higher. No. Uh, way higher. Oh, come on. This is never going to work, is it? Oh, God. If I direct hit you with a plasma... No, there's no way. There's no way. I will kill myself. I have to try. Boop. <gasps> Weapon charge depleted. Boop. Please. Please. One time. Oh, God. One time. One time. Wait, I've damaged him. I've damaged him with a plasma launcher. Boop. Uh, they're immune to it. Come on, go to the ground. Go to the ground. Come on, surely I... I'm doing little chip damage. How am I doing so little damage? It was a freaking plasma launcher. <laughs> this, this is a terrible weapon. Since when is it so bad? I'm doing chip damage to them. I don't even kill the animal. What is this? I killed what? Oh my god. Maybe I just need to direct hit them. Oh god, a swarm is flying. I didn't really think this through really, did I? I'm out of unstable plasma. Uh, I have no room, I have no room. Disengage. No. Wait. Uh, uh, switch to paralysis cloaking device. I'm cloaked. You stupid fools. I am invisible. I run away. The swarm is hunting. Too bad. 
I'm invisible. It annoys me that animals don't realize that you're invisible. Why, hello. Empty supply depot. I wonder who stole all of that. I wonder. I should probably be really getting towards this rendezvous, shouldn't I? Twelve minutes away. I could hike there and get radiant shards along the way. I need to make some space. What do we get rid of? I don't need this. I don't need this. I don't need this. Movement, please. Movement, one time. No. What else don't I need? I don't need this. Uh, I kind of want everything else for the time being. Oh, I don't need this. I want some metal platings. I want some unstable plasma. I want to charge up. Right, then we're good. So, I will take a jetpack plant. I don't want a copper. I want a jetpack plant. And we will head in the direction of the rendezvous. This is a bit mad though. Perhaps I should fly there. Although I need radiant shards. I got whipped by a whippy plant. Oh, look at the flock of them. Look how many there are. Have you ever seen so many gecklings in your whole entire life? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And there's some behind me. What a flock. Glorious. This is what I'm talking about. Density in games. This is more dense than Diablo. <laughs> a whole pack. Very good. Wait. There's another one. Well, hello. I need to kill you. I'm sorry about this, buddy. I need to kill you too. Can you even damage me with your normal mode weapons? Huh? I fell down a hole. Can you stop repairing? Can you stop repairing? Oh, my weapon is so pathetically weak. I don't know how many of these I'm supposed to kill, but... There's a hedgehog. What base is this? Pilgrimage to low orbital overwatch. So many people have built bases on top of the mountains. It's pretty cool. Should we go have a look at it? Surely there's a landing pad up there. I can't summon the ship though. Radiant Shard, one time. Radiant Shard, please. I think I see a Radiant Shard. Let us go grab Radiant Shard. Ouch. We need 16. Is this number 8? I don't even know. I've lost count. Two more. Added to la collection. Ten. We have ten. Wait, they stack in tens. In more. It's trying to get me to the rendezvous. Wait, it's only 500 you away. We're actually pretty close. It's going to be on top of this damn mountain. Am I really going to have to climb this thing? I think we're going to have to summit this. Oh god, it's going to take forever. Let's climb to the top. Target is a line, 300 you away. That's fairly close. Uh, frost crystal. I didn't even realize we were in a frosty world. I wouldn't have guessed it. 
Have I ever been on a frosty dissonant world? I don't know that I have. Isn't that bizarre? I don't remember being on one. No wonder I don't recognise it. There's so many cool bases. Oh my god, there's another cool base. It looks like a gun. There's another cool base. It looks like a Japanese something or other. I kind of want to go visit these bases. There's another cool base. <laughs> There's so many bases here. There's another cool base. No, nope, that's not a base. That's a galactic network. Where are we actually going? 147U towards the galactic network. Go invisible and flurry them. <laughs> uh, if only, hey. Right. Another cool base. Finalizing signal. What am I supposed to do? I've completed it. We found it. Why look at that. What do we have here then? Harmonic scrap. I don't have room is one problem. Oh God. What do we get rid of? Get rid of you. I'm picking up goop and mold. Oh my god, wait, what is this? Suspicious Beckett. Another nip nip. Another nip nip. How many nip nips are we getting? It's kind of a bit strange. Let's get rid of you. Right, what are we supposed to do here? Speak to this guy. The scrapper's camp is much like the first. Half-built machines. Abandoned attempt at a new technology. The unwanted or unprofitable remains of countless salvage operations. Which of these categories did this autophage belong to? Probe. Attempt. Probe. Let's probe. 6 plus 1. 7. 13. 2. 7. 13. 2. Seven, thirteen, two. A light flickers on somewhere deep within these long abandoned circuits. Inaudibly, a lock is broken. Dump memory contents. Hands to grasp everything that was owned to us. Rubbed, betrayed, purged. Hmm. I extract what I can from the autophage's de decomposing memory. It appears to contain another set of construct schematics. Ooh. Construct for limbs. Quad servo, nanotubules, wiring loom. Wiring loom. Well, we've just played a pirate save where we were desperate. Wait, we were playing Hudless. Where we were desperate for wiring looms. And how did we get wiring looms? We deconstruct technology. And we get a wiring loom. The only problem is I need three slots. And I don't have three slots. Let's just get rid of a hyaline brain. Let's get rid of Pugnum? Question mark. One, two, three slots. I will salvage this one. We have a wiring loom. And I need more space. Copper. We've got a million copper on the ship. And we can construct... Where is it? A limb! We have a head. We have a limb. Am I supposed to make two limbs? Question mark. One limb. Hands to grasp. Construct the construct arms. Very good. Right, let me get my rewards. 1,000 nanites, space computer plans, salvage data 24, bidden exosuit module. Can I fit all of this? Guess we find out. Well, look at this, another wiring loom. 
I'll keep you there. I'll keep you there. We, this didn't finish making, did it? We have chromatic metal. And we have a million copper. Whatever. That will do for now. Right. Wait, there's another reward. Construct limbs schematic. Lubricant plans. Okay. Is this a different one? This is the same one. Lubricant. Why would it teach me lubricant, eh? Am I going to need to build this stuff? Is my ship full? No, my ship's not full. I just don't have it here with me right at this second, but we could fix that. We could dump stuff on the ship. My ship is almost full. With gold and chromatic met no, gold and copper. We've been visiting player mines. Wait, a radiant shard. Don't have room. What do we dump on the ship? You can go on the ship. You can go on the ship. Nip nip can go on the ship. You can go on the ship. This can go on the multi tool. What are you? Oh, spitter. What else can go on the ship? Salvage data can go on the ship. Uh, that'll do for now. Right, so I need another five radiant shards. And I need to hide myself from the storm. Hide myself from the storm. Right, let's have a look. What else? So we need to do extract radiant shards. I've already done hands to glass. Oh, we get a hazmat. I guess we are going to have to go get lubricant made or something along those mines. So I want to install hazmat gauntlet. What else could I install? I can't afford it. Okay. Right, so I need to go present the construct to the Atlas. But I also need Radiant Shards. So I should probably go get Radiant Shards. I also want to go visit some of these bases. Let's go visit a base. Which base do we want, though? There's so many! Can I see anything? I cannot see anything. Uh... We were seeing so many when it wasn't storming. Mounting base. Let's try this one. The pilgrimage to Overwatch. Eleven of sixteen shards so far. Yes, I need five more. I think we'll go farm them on this planet before we leave this place. Let's go hide from the storm. We have a teleporter. We have a save point. This must be a buildable item these days. Pilgrimage to edited by Sizzling Bacon. What a name. Sizzling Bacon. We have people with really cool names. A naughty somebody other. Wait, there's a shop. Can I sell anything? What could we sell? What could we sell? My ship. I can't sell stuff from my ship. That's annoying. I want to sell something from my ship. I have so much copper to sell. Let's sell copper and gold. Make some money. Sell all copper. 900. We've got 3.5 million units. We've got 5 million units. I think we're rich enough. Is there anything I want? I will buy a stack of microprocessors. Who knows when we might need them. I will buy a stack of fuel. Who knows when... Wait, does it stack in tens? What does it stack in? I don't know. I will buy all the ferret dust. I will buy all the cobalt. I will buy all the nanotubules. I will buy all the metal bladings. I buy the silver. I will buy all the uranium rest of it I don't care about to be honest what a terrible shop 
Right, so I need Radiant Shards, and there's also bases to go visit. They all look similar though, don't they? Where's the one that looked like a Japanese base? Not you. There's one that looked really fascinating. Can I spot it anywhere? There's a base on top of the mountain. Let's go to the one on top of the mountain. I like the idea of flying high. So many bases. It's not a good planet for farm radiant shards on though. It's difficult to walk around. Coming in for a landing. Why look at this? A cuboid structure. Why hello? A portable refiner. Object in use. What bug is this? Are you not allowed to use other people's portable refiners anymore? You used to be able to use that, didn't you? And we have more of the same. I will take the pure ferrite. There's 10,000 gold for sale, eh? 4.4 4 million units. No, I don't want it. Right, I'm bored. Let's go find our radiant shards. Radiant shards. Let me make sure my starship is charged. Let's dive! Looking for radiant shards. There's another base. There's another base. Wait, there's the Japanese base. Let's go have a look at this Japanese base. They can set their refiners as usable, not usable. Why would they make them not usable? I just took a load of damage. I barely touched this thing. I want to jump all the way over there, but what if I suicide? I need my shield back. Do you reckon I could make that jump? I feel that's a bit too far. With my current jetpack. Can I have my shields back, please? Please? Are my shields not going to recover? Yes, they are. Good. Calabunga! I have no jetpack. I have no jetpack. I have literally no jetpack. This isn't good. That's a long way away. Boop. 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 Is there any way I can make it to the mountain? Uh, uh. Uh, oh god. Oof. What I wouldn't give for a jetpack upgrade. Well, we've made it to the foot of a Japanese style base. Ouch. No radiant shards, unfortunately. Who builds bases that are not next to radiant shards these days? Radiant shard, one time. Can I look for radiant shards? I should probably be looking for them, really, shouldn't I? I don't even see any. Right, let's go walk up to the steps. There's a flag. Is that a camp? Is that the camp I was just at? Wait, what the hell is that? Is that a base? That's a base. Singularity Station. Interesting. Another base. It's kind of cool seeing all these people's bases, like... <laughs> all these mountains all over the place. Base. 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 There's a base above me. There's a whole civilization here. Ah, carbon. I, I need it, carbon. I'll take carbon. Thank you very much. There's a crackling fireplace. Unfortunately, they've made it purpley blue instead of the gorgeous color it used to be. I don't know why they did that. There's a large refiner that is not allowed to be used. And there is a storage, which... I could use. 
but they can't build, so I would just lose it. There's also an antimatter reactor. No, I need antimatter. Wait, does this make antimatter? How does this work? I never built this thing. How do I get these? I need antimatter. Generator. How long do you take? Fuel the reactor to generate antimatter. Are you generating? Please? How long do you take? Right, whilst I'm doing stuff here, you generate. I will have a look in these boxes to get some life support jelly. More life support jelly. And a battery. Please, have an antimatter. <gasps> One antimatter! I'll take it. And I'll put it on the ship. Won't put it on the ship. The ship is out of range. I have space. All oh, good. Hey, Paddywhack, how are you doing? How is life treating you, Paddywhack? Been a while since I've seen you around. Right, I need... What do I need? Radiant shards. How do we get radiant shards? I want another antimatter. Give me another one. Looks like it needs to process 10% for it to make one. It's too long. Too slow. Right. Where's that other base? I've lost it. Too many bases here. I really need my flying eagle. There's this one here. Kind of looks interesting. Like, what the hell is it? It's so far away. I'm going to have to fly over. Wait, can I summon my landing? I don't have any nav datas. What idiot didn't stop and pick up those nav datas when they were on the floor? Like, what idiot said nav datas are not needed? I don't need nav datas. Like, I need nav data. I need nav data. And I don't have any. Now I'm going to have to jump down and summon my ship. Like a plebeian. Oh well. Try not to get myself killed along the way. Is that a radiant shard? Why, I think it is. Don't mind if I do. I need another eight or so. Not even. There's also more sentinels to go murder. Maybe I should look at how many I actually need to kill. Does it tell me anywhere? Illuminate 19? 19 can re Oh my god. I need to murk them all. I did see a few of them. I swear it. I hear something. Where have they gone? There. If I shoot this dude, I can annoy them. Then I can murk them all. Come here, you. I need to kill 19 of you. Ooh. Wait, I have a plasma launcher. Surely this is amazing in this situation. Please, one time, one time, be good. That's not good. Boop. Are you really not able to one-shot one of these things? I thought this was supposed to be an amazing weapon. 600 damage. I didn't feel very good. What is shooting at me? Oh, oh my god, it's a quad. It's a quad. He's launching missiles at me, and I'm launching missiles right back. Boop. I'm doing chip damage to a quad. Boop. 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 I missed. Wait, he's a better shot than I am. This isn't good. This is not fair. I'm getting whipped by a whippy plant as well. I think we disengage. 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 
charge up as well. Right, I still need some more radiant shards before we leave this place. Why look at that! Ask and you shall receive. Right, how am I doing? There's one on the ship. 13. 14. I need two more. Will it count the ones that I've got on the ship? You can get upgrades as you go to make it better. You can take them off other multi tools now. Yes, I managed to get myself a plasma launcher. Which I don't normally use because I normally play permadeath and it kind of... I actually should test it. Does it still one-shot the player? Should I kill myself just to find out? I never play with it. What if they've changed it and it doesn't one-shot you anymore? I don't want to kill myself. I need another Radiant Shard. That is not a Radiant Shard. Do you reckon there's one next to it and it just hasn't spawned in yet? Question mark? Does not look like it, does it? But you never know. I'll go have a look. Ooh. Wait, a corrupt swarm. Why, hello. I need to kill you. My gun is so bad. My gun is so bad. I need to kill you too. Come yeah, on. And I need bullets. Give me bullets. Why well, look at that! There's an out... There is a... Wait. Yeah, wait. This didn't used to take long. They've changed it. There's another base. Let's go say hello to the other base. Oh! <gasps> radiant shards! Base, radiant shards. Base, radiant shards. Radiant shards. Of course we go for the radiant shards. Go say hello to the base once we're done farming. We were banging this out. Why look at that! Two Radiant Shards! Just what we needed! Radiance extracted 16 Radiant Shards. Yes! Sodium. We're low on Sodium. I'll take it. Let's say hello to this base! I've been scanning creatures, have I? <laughs> I get so much money. I should be scanning creatures. Why, hello, little mini base. I'll say hello to you too. And save my game, why not? Who made this little base? Santigo Kulink. Shout out to Santigo Kulink. My little rest stop on this journey. There's my ship. Five minutes in the sky. Brilliant. Right, so. My inventory is full, damn it. What can I get rid of? What can we get rid of in my ship? What can I get rid of onto my ship? Inverted mirrors. These things. Radiant shards can now go on the ship. Antimatter belongs on the ship. Launch will belongs on the ship. Excess carbon nanotubules don't need to be here. Fuel can be on the ship. Right, can I leave this place? Let's collect this. Pre-packaged optical drill unit, supreme mining beam, banned hazard protection. They really want our hazard protection good. Like, that's the third hazard protection they've given us. Are they taking us to an extreme planet soon? Mining beam. Another hazard protection. An optical belt. Very good. All in the wrong place, but beggars can't be choosers. Give me some money. Give me even more money. Give me even more money. 
More money. Right, I think we're rich enough. Right, what's up next on the agenda? Done, 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 done. Go speak to the Atlas. Forge the second thing. Let's go find an Atlas station. Beautiful planet. I still gonna need to find more corrupt sentinels at some point. But we're doing well. We're doing well. Let's look on. This time I need to remember to take my what you would call it. Wait, will it actually tell me where to go? I need current mission. Why hello Atlas Station in one jump. Right, remember to get warp cells. Let's try and do it this time, because I will slowly run out. Are we going to need lubricant to craft? I have a feeling it's going to want lubricant. Brain dead system. Wait, what? Brain dead system? Hello Games didn't name this brain dead system, did they? This must be somebody else. I'm still rich. Uh, I don't want to waste my hypoco yet. I still have another jump. They definitely improved the graphics inside the Atlas stations, didn't they? Deep me a word. Traveller. Give me... Whoop cell. I will use these ones. Why do I find myself here again? Why should the Atlas care about me? About my construct? Such an insignificance could scarcely register at the Atlas infinite scale. And yet, here I am. Present the construct parts. All creation is the language of the Atlas. It will not speak to me now, but everything I see, everything I hear, everything I choose to do, that is its message, its speech. How profound. Despite my doubts, the Atlas, this impossible serene machine, reacts. Does it speak to me? To the Contra? To something else? Perhaps I will never know, but I will continue. Seed of Power. A seed of creation, a tiny drop of the infinity of the Atlas. A particle of indescribable energy. It is unclear how to... It to continues to exist within this reality. Wait, it is unclear how to continues to. I think that's a typo. They have done a typo. It is unclear how it continues to exist within this reality. Use E to resonate the seed, converting its waveform into the audible range. Visited the second Atlas station. That is make seed of power. That is resonate. Resonate. Uh. Doesn't resonate. Forge the second atlas seed. Reach the third rendezvous point. Right, let's get my rewards. Warp hypercore times two. Perfect. Just what we needed. Wait, what did we get? Pre-packaged neutron cannon unit, supreme cannon upgrade, pre-packaged P-field compressor unit. What the hell is all of that? These like weapon upgrades for my ship. No, a nutrient cannon. I see. Can I repair any of this? Yes. I 
I'm spending this stuff. If we need it again, I guess I'll have to go collect it. I just want some slots. We now have a neutron cannon. Perfect. What else did we get? This thing. Oh, I already have that. Oh well. Get rid of that then. Oh, another one. All the graphic updates makes it run like a slug in a potato mode. Oh no. Oh dear, I'm having a bit of a coughing fit. I didn't bring enough water. Right, give me a second, I'm going to just grab some water. With a bit of water, much better. Uh, phase two reward complete. So what do we get for this? Crimson, Crimson Freighter Trail customization. Discordant Trail. What the hell is that? Ooh, a jetpack trail. Ooh, I want this. Augmented with an atladium filter. When activated, its discordant effect is spilled across the landscape, a trail of dissonant reverberations that echo in an unknown frequency. I kind of want to do that. Do we get access to the ne Nexus? I guess I go visit a Nexus and try it out. A space station. A space station would do, is not it? Oh, what have I pressed? Sorry about that. When did I do that? I'm moving my chair, pressing a hotkey, an old hotkey that I don't use anymore. Don't do that. Right. Space station. Let's nip to the space station. Nexus. I can go to the Nexus. Let's go to the Nexus. Not live screen there. Thank you, Mihal. I noticed, thankfully. I sat down on my chair and knocked a button. Unprofessional streamer, you see. Oh, we yeah, have that collector's edition for Starfield is pretty pricey, isn't it? Even the game pre-order seems fairly pricey. I was surprised. Although I suppose it, the collector's editions are always pricey, but are they really that much? Kind of out of most people's price range. Right, let's try this jetpack. Where is it? Backpack and 10. It must be 10. Here we go. I change the colour of it or not? And that's just my suit. Okay. Whoa, whoa, oh my goodness me. It really is. It's pink. It's a little bit pink. Yeah, let's rock it for now, why not? Do I want my other ship? Collect expedition rewards. I will take a utopia speedster. Why not? There. I will buy it. A thousand nanites. Whatever. We have a utopia. Oh yes, they've changed it that you need to pay nanites now, so you don't get it like straight away. 
It's Bethesda, so never cheap. I just didn't expect it to be that much. I wonder if it's actually worth that much in terms of the quality of the products. To be honest, the game is probably going to give you years of ex As long as it's a good game and you enjoy it, it's going to give you years of play time, isn't it? It's a kind of, kind of game that you can almost have infinite replayability with, with all different ways you could play it. Different character builds and things. And yeah. Huge, massive, almost infinite, but not quite, universe. Standard is 60 quid. I suppose it's not too bad. What's premium? What's the difference between standard and premium? I mean, that's how much I played for Diablo, I suppose. It's just a AAA game, isn't it? Everything's just so expensive these days. Life is too expensive. Actually, I normally take food to work, and I literally went didn't have food, so I went to get myself a sandwich. I got myself a sandwich, a single sandwich, and a drink of milkshake. And it cost me almost seven quid. Seven quid for, like, a cheese and lettuce sandwich. And a drink. Like, what the hell? Oh, God, life. Right, what are we doing? And where are we going? We've done phase two. On to phase three. We'll do the next pilgrimage. Onwards. Early access and a bunch of skins. God, it's the early access. They know how to get people in it, don't they? Early access to games. We will sell it to you for an extra 30 quid. It's such a devious, brilliant strategy. Right, I'm on free explore. I want current mission. It's all the way over there. It's going to take me a couple of jumps. Hey, Cynthia, how are you doing? I'm having a little break from Diablo to play my No Man's Sky expedition. Although I'll probably end up playing Diablo once I finish the stream, to be honest. Because I have to stay up all night because I'm doing night shifts tomorrow. I suppose I could stream that as well, but no. I'll relax with Diablo. Play No Man's Sky for streaming content. What am I doing? Do I need to go to a space station? I don't feel like we do. Or at least if we do, I don't know why. Wait. We're going from dissonance to dissonance. Even fast food, it, yeah, oh my god, don't. We drove down to visit my mum and we stopped at a Burger King. Or was it a KFC? Maybe it was both. But even then, like, just a simple... Like, two of us had something to eat. 20 quid. 20 quid! For, like... I don't mind spending money, but, like, my God! Like, it's just a burger. It's a simple burger. How can it be so expensive? Most of you probably don't know British... Pounds. Pound is weak. <laughs> You just completed your second expedition. Do you mean the second phase? Or is this your second ever expedition? Mihal says he started some Starfield channels in the C checks Discord. Yes. If you want to talk, if you want to hype up, if you want to look for information, I guess that's where you go. And you can talk with like-minded Starfield fans. I'm sure most of the No Man's Sky community are going to enjoy having a go at Starfield, at least. I mean, it's a very different game, but it, it's, got, it's got a lot of potential. I'm just slightly worried the planets will be... Void. I'm very curious how planetary exploration will be. Why, look at this base. Why, I see a ship on the ground. 
He's parked his base near a ship. We could have a look at the ship as well. Hey, Jeffers, how are you doing, buddy? I'm having a little break from Noom, from Diablo. Uh, do my expedition. And I keep coming across random bases. And they look fabulous. Don't mind if I do. There's some Christmas trees. What is this noise? This is roof. What is the sound here? Like the sound of a robot. You're not an S class, are you? You haven't built an, a ship next to an S class interceptor ship, have you? I've got the wrong bloody. How do I get rid of this? I want to look at this. I need to change. Oh, what button do you press? This one. It's a C class. Ah, C class, eh? But I might take your glass and bug them. I'll leave the brain. Upgrade? No. You've done two full expeditions. Congratulations. Which ones did you do? Don't tell me the rewards. I still don't know the rewards. I want to be surprised with the main reward. Right, what am I doing here? Rendezvous. Uh, ooh, weed, what? I've lost the rendezvous. Target suite unavailable. Oh god, it's giving me the plong. It's giving me the light. I need to abandon this. Give me as a mission. There we go. 2000! 2000! kidding me? It's because I'm at somebody else's base. Of course it is. Let's take the ship. If void planets are an issue, no man's sky is full of them. Well, no man's sky has some nice creatures. Well, I, I don't know. I guess it, until we play it, we won't know, will we? Right. I guess it was taking me to this. Which is probably taking me to this. Let's just try it. Probably taking me to the computer inside. Great. Gravitational abnormality let's hide is it really not gonna ne oh no is it not is it gonna send me here but at the moment I can't do it don't do this to me game is it gonna let me do it this is something different isn't it oh no I think it's trying to send me here, but it doesn't let me do it yet. Extreme weather. Now, is this something I need to be worried about? This doesn't normally cause problems, does it? It's like weird gravity. But I can't see a thing. It, it's going to take me all the way back to the... God, it's so far away. I'm going to have to go fly there. I, gonna, I think it's going to send me right back here. But let's do what it wants me to do. You still fly in that cellar with so many interceptors to be had. <laughs> We've had a look at them, but I'm a bit fussy. I don't want to take any interceptor. Oh my god, it's still so far away. 1400 of you. Let's just 
gravitationally go towards it. We'll use the gravity storm to help us get there. Maybe this is the purpose. Maybe it's a timed gravity storm. So that you can dart your way along. Kind of cool, actually. It will be a camp, yes, probably. You're right. We've got superhero music. Because we're superheroes. Perfect music. With my fancy swishy jetpack. Which is bonus javity bump jumping capabilities. I cannot see a thing. Apparently we are aligned. We're getting close. I'm going the wrong way. There it is. We found it. Right. We made it. Completed the third pilgrimage. With the climax to the music. Perfect. <laughs> Right, let's have a look. The autophagous circuit cage sits alone, a last witness to whoever fled this camp. Probe the damage registers. One plus one is two. Just a second, my wife just. Right, so like that. Right, one plus one is two. Eleven minus three is eight. Oh god. Two eight thirteen. Let's have a look. The autophagous circuit gauge sits alone, a last witness to whoever fled this camp. The smoke in the gravity storms is ridiculous, it is very low visibility. Oh god, I was not paying attention. What was it? I have to have another look. Oh god. Was it 2.38? I don't remember. I wasn't paying enough attention. I was distracted. I will guess. Oh, thank god. A fan slowly whirs into life somewhere within the autophagus shell. Slow, pulsing whine. Um, the memory contents. The Atlas does not care. Rhyme, void, glass, it is all the same cycle. We from the glassy abyss. What is it trying to tell me? I must admit the lore always gets me a bit lost in this game. The data is in far better condition than the rusty remains of its housing would suggest. It is a third component, a shell, to go with the construct. Schematics I have already recovered. A shell! Oh no, we need crystal sulfide. I need more life support. I need more magnetized ferrite. Okay. There's a bone cat. Right, we need this to turn into magnetized ferrite. We need another life support. And we need three crystal sulfides. We need water. Good to see a doctor can do math. <laughs> Uh, yeah, don't test my math skills. Right. 
Yeah, my daughter's trying to do trigonometry at the moment. I can't remember trigonometry. It's been years since I did trigonometry. I vaguely recall. Right, what are we doing? Where are we going? Oh, I can get rewards. Let's do that. Nanites, expansions, storage. Okay. What else? Construct shell, supreme movement. Ah, movement. Repackage voltaic amplifier. Okay. I'm accidentally shooting plasma launcher. Don't do that. I will take the movement upgrade. Thank you very much. We'll take an amplifier. Thank you very much. What does this one do? Now it's to stunned. I think it's time to get rid of the explosive. Ah, no, no, we'll keep it. What else? So I need to kill more sentinels. I need to go find water. Now this is a dissonant planet. Killing sentinels on dissonant planets is kind of nice. So let's go find some sentinels to merc. How many do we need? I need ten. There's a joke about tangents in here somewhere. <laughs> you had to relearn algebra for your electrician exam. It's, it's silly, isn't it? Like, simple maths that we all have done as a kid. But like, you, who uses algebra in the real, real, real world? Unless you're some nerd. Like Nihal, who's a nerd. Because obviously he knows how to do algebra. With his fancy electrician exams. <laughs> right, I need sentinels. How am I going to find sentinels? Perhaps if I shoot an animal. No, that doesn't piss them off on this. Where's a gravitino ball? Who's been killing all of the, the freaking rhinos? Me. Oop. Wait, what? How is this so bad a weapon? This used to be, like, one-shot everything. Have they nerfed it to the ground? Are you kidding me? It takes three shots. It takes three shots to kill a big boy. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six shots. A bit tanky, aren't they? Pretty cool creature, actually. Whoop. 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 Okay, I'll stop messing around. Uh, what are we doing? I need sentinels. I find sentinels. I need one of those inverted mirror dudes. Can we see one? Shards. I didn't see one anywhere. Do you see a bird? Trigonometry, wow, period. Is she had her grade level? Is that standard? Uh they do things slightly different here. She's doing her uh, mock kind of exams the year before her kind of main exams. I haven't had her results yet, particularly. They're doing okay. I think they do but They're kind of above their peers, but I don't know. Is it rude to say their peers are not brightest? Is that just real life? What is this? Are you feasting on him? You're actually eating the fool. Oh my god. That's a big bum. But there's just dead animals everywhere. Let's leave this evidence behind, shall we? Right. I need to find some sentinels to kill, and we're not... Uh, 
A sentinel to kill. Whoop. No. Whoop. No. Does that go through him? This does like no damage to sentinels, by the way. You're back to my trusty bolt caster. Oh, he's got a freaking flamethrower. That's not fair. Oh god, a repair bot. They're too strong. They're repairing each other. Got him out of bullets. I can't repair. <laughs> I can't repair. They, they out heal me. Die. Oh my god, he's roasting me. Wouldn't it be embarrassing if I die in normal mode? It can be hilarious. I'd love it actually. <laughs> oh dear. Right, two down. Eight more to go. I probably don't want the big swarm, do I? Or do I? I do. Come on. My bolt guards do so crap. Wait, I got a neutron cannon. Are you any good? Uh, actually, you're much better. Okay, neutron cannon it is. a bit better. Uh, I just want to kill the little dudes. I don't really want to kill the big dude. Are you coming here to pounce on me? You are trying to pounce on me. Time to disengage. The heat is too hot. The heat is way too hot. There's far too many of you. I don't have my escape pet. <laughs> I'll run slowly. Wait, we have a... What you call it? A cloaking device. I am invisible. Nobody can see me. We are stealthed. Or fools. In fact, if I had a blaze javelin, I'd snipe them from a distance, but we don't. Oh god, I just used my life support jelly. I did not mean to use that. Can I get some of those? Where do they go? Do these count as kills? I killed all three of them. Does that count? I don't think it does, does it? You wish. Have I still not managed to kill them? Wait, have I already done it? I might have already done it. Did I get a reward? From what I've read, modding in Starfield is at another level. Wait, what? There can't already be a modding scene, surely. Wow, can you imagine? We need to go invisible. Nope, wrong one. I'm invisible. The swarm is hunting. They're severely pissed off. They're super pissed off. Run away. Before they spot me. You're invisible. Right, we are we safe? I did kill them. We had a life support module. And we get a shield. Perfect. Make use of that. We got two shields and a life support. Right, I need to make another jelly. I need to make another one of these. 
I need to go find Water Planet. Let's go. Mods in Bethesda games are always the real excitement. I wonder how much it's going to be like a Bethesda game. Did you play Fallout 76? I played Fallout 4. I played Fallout 76, but I only played it kind of once through. And then somehow I, it, it didn't really feel the same. Oh my god, there's another one. Communicate. Probe the structure. Oh my god. I actually got given a radiant shark. I feel I don't want to kill it this time around. Like, why should I? It does look interesting though. Right, I need water. Is there any water? Maybe that one. I'm trusting this to be water. But it's just pulled me into a dirty downland. Some smutty place. Frost crystal. Do you reckon it's got water? The shadow of the photo seemed to suggest, possibly. I didn't play Fallout 76, I did play 4. I played quite a lot of Fallout 4 a long time ago. I really loved it. But then I I didn't really replay it very much. When I first played Skyrim, I played like played it back to back like four or five times with completely different builds. Then I never played that again either. It's kind of strange. Is this a water planet or not? Like, I cannot even tell. This does not look very watery right where we are, does it? How am I going to find out? Why don't I look at the discoveries? Like, what am I doing with my life? That is not watery. That is not water. Wait, this is water. This is water. I need to go to this planet. Nodoloma Hitter. Where are you, Nodoloma? Water planet! Let's go get some crystal sulfide. Read an article where they stated that nearly all MS Xbox quality assurance staff are testing Starfield to have the lowest bug release Bethesda game ever. I mean, that's really cool. Those lucky, lucky people. But a Bethesda game with not very many bugs? Whatever bug there is, it's going to be... People are going to make big noise about it, aren't they? I really don't have much music in my playlist today, do I? I need to go get some more music. Uh, oh god, I should have prepped a playlist. Let me do something like this. Let me do something like this. And it's playing. Right, we need to go swimming. I need some crystal sulfide. I didn't get the biggest water. I should have gone to bigger water. Why did I come? Let's go to a big water. I wonder what they can do with mods that won't be in the base game. I suppose they can make dedicated quest lines and things. Why can I not land? Game. Let me land. I have crystal sulfide to go farm. Right. Where is crystal sulfide when you need it? I spot some. I think we only need three. That's just one plant, isn't it? 
don't have that much oxygen. Eh, good enough. One, two, three. Right, we've made it. A shell to make whole. And I will get my supreme defensive system upgrade and a load of life support gels. We're getting stronger. They have room to place this stuff. Present the construct shell to the Atlas. Brilliant. Atlas station time. Chicken will need more. Probably not. Should we take more anyway? Am I going to regret not taking more? I'm not going to take more. We're going to live to regret it. Down the line. But surely we've done the part that needs crystal sulfide. They wouldn't need that again, would they? Okay, tell me guys, what was your most exciting reveal or thing that you've seen from the Starfield demo play, play through that they showed? Is there something that you're particularly surprised or excited about? They showed so much. I'm surprised they showed so much. It was pretty cool. I don't understand though. Is it true that you you don't get an animation for landing on planets. Like, is that really so hard for them to have implemented? It seems like a glaring omission. Why is that? I guess it's the transitioning to planets or something. Right, let's go to the Atlas. The planets look pretty awesome. I thought the creatures looked really cool. And some of some of the the, the the dinosaurs and stuff on planets looked really cool. I was surprised there was so much building and stuff already. Some of the systems looked a little clunky to use. Or I don't know, the, the graphical UI looked a little bit I suppose like that, you have to get used to it, don't you? Right, we need to go to an Atlas station. Let us find... Is that going to show me? Why did it just... Yeah, that's not taking me to an Atlas station. Is it taking me? It's taking me, but it's quite far away. Right, let's go to this Atlas station. I'm also interested in how all the, the, the tech progression goes. How well you can specialize your players. Oh, I'm going to crash. God, of course, there's a freaking battle. We already had battles. Why am I getting more battles? I don't want to fight this. Is there a space station I can escape to? Leave me alone. Space pirating. Yeah, boarding the other ships, that was quite amazing, isn't it? That's pretty cool, actually. Taking over a pirate ship and adding it to your collection. That's actually really cool. I wonder what the consequences of dying will be. Do you reckon death will have consequence? Wait, is there going to be permadeath? Wait, do I want to play permadeath in Starfield? That seems bonkers, doesn't it? What if I get eaten by a dinosaur?
I mean, it's pretty, it's pretty cool that you can board and take the ship. I wonder how good the economy is going to be. I hope there's like a robust economy. And it feels meaningful to do stuff in game. But the problem is that there's always people who want to play really casually and then people who want real more the struggles to survive. It's difficult to make the game cater to both tastes. Why am I here? I'm escaping sentinels, aren't I? No, pirates. Well, hello, ship. All right, let's go. The return of dread Barrett Tien. <laughs> uh. I'm probably going to go creature hunting. And I'm going to probably build a stealthy, snipery, silencer carrying pistol assassin explorer. That doesn't go together, does it? But <laughs> that's what I'm going to do. I like stealthy gameplay. And I like sniping. And I like exploring. But what am I doing? I, I, I'm casually not going where I'm supposed to go. I want to go to the Atlas Station. Luckily with mods, people can lean into as much realism as they can. I don't know. I'm, I don't know why. Like, I prefer to play the base game naturally as intended. I guess late down the line, mods to tweak the experience. I'm too worried about mods that just break the game. Mods that will break the economy. Give you infinite money. Or, I, I don't know, just make things meaningless. I really like it in game when you, you have to work hard for something, but then you've got something that nobody else has. Right. We are here again. Oh, don't fall off. And another word. Atlas word for the. The autophage where I la found, last found the construct schematic relayed a message of the void of the Abyss of Glass. It accused the, at accused the Atlas of indifference and promised freedom. But the contract construct is a shell. It is not alive. Resent. The construct has no mind. It is only a shell. I wonder, does this distinction matter to the Atlas? Does it even see the difference? The Atlas once again passes its incomprehensible verdict on my creation. On my presence at this interface. Seed of Will. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. I know it's cobalt. I literally just saw some in the shop. I did buy some cobalt. I wonder if I've got enough. Please? Ooh, it's going to be tight. Energy 148. That's enough, isn't it? Perfect. I bet the first of the game mods will be adding value to the modular ship construction to replicate sci-fi game mods. Yeah. The warping looked kind of impressive as well, didn't it?
it's going to be very interesting to watch how it all unfolds. Right, we have a seed of wealth. What next? Earn 3,000 nanites. Oh, God. Seriously? I'm close. Is there any way I didn't upload something? Upload all. Isn't there an upload all button somewhere? I never clicked this button. Upload all. Please have enough? <sighs> Not quite. Uh, where did we... Where's the planet with the creatures that we saw? Uh, I'm going to have to go do a zoology. Wait, I can refine. What can I refine? Doesn't this go into nanites? Three hundred and fifty nanites. Perfect. Oh, paddy wax has refined crystals. Yes. Well done. Great minds think alike. Anyone going for the collector's stuff? It's really expensive in my country. I. I'm not usually a big person, and at that price, I probably can't even entertain it. It looks very cool, though. I saw them showcase the watch and the case. It looks very interesting. I'll probably be going for the premium version, although I suppose it depends really what the premium version gives. What, what are we doing now? Next rendezvous? Get my rewards. Three storm crystals. That's basically hypercore cells. Let's build those. Amount of antimatter. Amount of condensed carbon. Ah, well. I don't need to do that yet. What else? Wait, do I have my nanites? We have nanites. Cluster horde. Right. Collect my seeds. Fragmented Kralia? What? Activated Indium? What's it, what random stuff is it giving me? Do we need this stuff? You will pre-order the premium edition. Many people say don't pre-order games, but Starfield is just one of those games that everybody's going to pre-order, surely. Uh, and we can get cluster horde. Claim expedition. Terrifying sample prepackaged launched autocharger. Okay. Yes. We got a floppy eye. Kind of interesting name. Floppy eye. I wish more stuff than just the treasures for documents had interesting names. Yeah, I had a bit of a coughing fit. And a sip of water. Right. Oh, and we get the phase three rewards. Crystallized drone plants. What is that? Ah, that's the plant that everybody's been building. There we go then. Wait, you can actually build living fragments. Oh, so you could plant living fragments at your base. Oh. 
UK Game Shop has an exclusive. I'm surprised they've got an exclusive. I, I find that really weird. Because surely that limits how much they'll sell. Or oh, everybody goes to Game Shop? I mean, some people just don't shop at Game Shop. So let's get on with things. We've got all our rewards. Armed of these four. Complete the fourth pilgrimage. It's very kind of linear, isn't it? We've not had to like dart around. It's just all going in the right direction. Why is it taking me here and not to wherever it is we're supposed to go? Is it so far away? Game Shop is the biggest retailer in the UK, yes. But it's very monopolistic, isn't it? To only allow one store to sell the game. I wonder how much they're paying to have that privilege. I should have tried to get some upgrades for the ship, but hey ho. Oh, come on, it keeps putting it into free explore. Hyperdrive is no fuel, no. trying to conserve fuel. Come on. The box is cool. It looks really cool. I'm not, I don't know, I don't, I'm not usually someone who buys collector's things, but it certainly does look interesting, but it's so expensive. How much is it in the USA? What, was it like £250 or something for a watch, a box and a game? Isn't that how much like a PlayStation costs these days? No, I'm sure that costs more. be in trouble if I spend that much in a game. <laughs> Constellation Edition is 300 US dollars. There you go. Isn't that a lot? Is that a normal price in the USA? Seems like a lot to me. From GameStop, eh? Are you going to get it, Michal? Or are you just going to get the game? Or are you just going to watch me play and not play? Just because you'd rather watch me play. <laughs> uh. Heck no, that's excessive. I know, it's so expensive, isn't it? Like, that's profit expensive. I wonder how many they'll sell. I mean, that's a lot of money, and these days, like everybody's, is tight on money. What with cost of living crisis and everything, like how many people can afford to put two hundred fifty quid just to play a game? Yeah, most likely I'll probably get premium edition unless the premium edition just doesn't feel. I mean, I'm not sure if I'll be paying for early access because it all depend on about 
what my rotor is and stuff if I've even got time to play. Now, what are we doing right now? I, I don't have radioactive protection. Oh god, wait, 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 wait. I don't have much, do I? I really don't have very much. What am I supposed to do here? Target aligned. Wait, sodium. I am on a radioactive planet and we were given a, re a lubricant recipe. Am I supposed to add two and two together and collect gamma root, do you reckon? I mean, is there a world that give me a lubricant recipe and we don't actually need to use it? That's neat, we're getting quite a lot of this stuff. Where are we going? This way. Plenty of sodium everywhere at least. I like collectibles, but really, do I need more stuff here? <laughs> you spent $150 for the Horizon Zero Dawn. I'll tell you now that tens of thousands will buy the 250 collectors as they'll see it as an investment. That's a very kind of a... But that means they can't open it and can't use it and can't display it. Like, there's no point having it as an investment and then using it. <laughs> Wait, hello, Autophage. Ten quad servos. I'll take those. Never know. Am I going the right way? I'm not going the right way. Perhaps we should start a donation fund for Constellation Premium Collector's Editions. <laughs> God, £250. Oh. You'd never take the watch off. I wonder how good quality the watch is, like if it actually works. And everything. You'd hope so. Five hundred you away. More storm crystals here, should we need them? Get busking. <laughs> right. Can we see this place yet? We need 270 you away. They're sending us to like the vastest of planets. But there we go. Why, hello. Milestone complete. Go say hello to the boy. Whoever built these autophages, whoever left them behind, did they intend for them to be the guardian of the construct, a repository they would return to? Rube. Four, ten, fifteen. Four, ten, fifteen. Four, ten, fifteen. Countless tiny servos begin to move, arms gliding across magnets, the click and the whir of data coming to life. Shells consumed by fire, minds banished to the glass, forgotten but not as extinguished. The data flows from the autophage, clean, crisp, 
easy to decipher another construct schematic, as if it wants to be read. Legs! Oh god! This is why we need lubricant. I knew we would need lubricant. We also need wirings and resonators. I guess I need to go shopping. But I need more... I need two lubricants. How much do we need? I not land here. Lubricant day. Eh? How much does it cost? I need 800 gamma and 100 fecum. Mordite, do you turn into fecum? Do. You turn into a little bit of fecum. I need to murder animals. And I need to farm. Gamma. So I guess we want to stay on this planet and go murder stuff. Or I want to go fly and spot Gamma. I want to go fly, spot Gamma. And then murder stuff. Murder stuff or make stuff poop. Planet is vast and unwieldy. Finding gamma might be a challenge. I need a ley line. I need a gamma ley line. I love this song. Elegant music. Heroic music. Turn the music up. We can sail with this heroic music. Looking for Gamma Root. Go north, you say. Okay. What's this? No, I don't want a radioactive storm. Is it going to be easier to find just by walking on the planet? So I can actually scan. We'll go planet side. I better turn the music down before I break everybody's ears. Ship went up loud, not music. Oh no. There we go. I forgot. It goes game sounds and music. I don't have it on separate mixers. I'm not that talented. <laughs> I'll stop messing with my music settings. Why am I mining shards? I need gamma. It is gamma. Strawberry. There's not going to be any here, is there? And this is not good. I literally cannot find the gamma. Would it be easier to go find a different radioactive planet? Surely not. Maybe it is easier to find a different radioactive planet. But this planet is terrible for searching for stuff. What are the odds I go from planet to planet to planet and we can't find a radioactive planet? You know what, I'm going to try and find a better planet. Pl planet's a nightmare. 
Let's try and find a different radioactive world. Nice flat one with lots of animals to kill. Do I even have the recipe for creature pellets? Right, you are not Gamma. You might be Gamma. Please, one time, one time, one time. <gasps> easy. It's as easy as that. You just have to have talent at this game. Inbuilt talent to find and sniff out the right locations. Show me gamma plants. Why, hello. This is more like it. Big clusters. I need 800 gamma. And a load of creatures to murder. Or feed. Is it faster to feed them or is it faster to murder them? Can I even feed? Can I even make pellets? I need to make some room. What can I get rid of? Reach pellets. Oh god. Eat. All of you eat and poop. Whilst I get some gamma. Yes, poop away. Will I be able to see the poop? It's going to be camouflaged on this place. It's kind of a nice planet, actually. You don't really get much gamma from these plants, do you? Maybe I should go to a trade platform and buy gamma. Actually, maybe that was a better, smarter move. Though I doubt I have an economy scanner. Eat, poop, and be merry. Why, look, we have poop. How much fecum did we need? I need two lubricants. I need a hundred. Hundred fecum. Eight, wrong one. Can I have the poop, please? Yes, all of you poop. Very nice, very nice. I cannot pick up the poop. Oh, God. Can you guys move out of the way? Oh, God. Come on, this way. Over here. Follow me. Come on. Duped. I can pick up all the poop. Oops, Cooper. Surely we have enough. Right, so I need to go get more gamma. How much did we manage to get? 560, eh? We have one lubricant. Aim more gamma. Trade station or lenders tend to sell it. And this planet seems fairly good. I just probably need just one more cluster. Surely we can find another cluster on this radioactive planet. Well, look at that glorious planet. Full of radioactive stuff. Glorious. A field of yellow. Like sunflowers. I didn't really pay attention to what else other than lubricant we needed. We needed those hydraulic things. Oh, we're going to have to get to a space station and get lucky. We haven't been given a recipe, have we? Wait. I could go to an anomaly and unlock the recipe. Maybe that's what we should do. Then my nanites. 
I have enough. I have more than enough. Right, we have two lubricants. Okay, with the what else do we need? Magnetic resonator, hydraulic wiring. I, we don't have that recipe, do we? Let's go get that recipe. Let's see if we can build it or not. I don't think I have what I need to build it anyway, but it might be easier to find that stuff than to find the wirings. Let's have a look. I've got some nanites. What can I put on my ship? Put this stuff on my ship. I suppose I could always actually go get soup slots, but see, I could get them here, isn't it? As a exosuit thing. I did that as well. What do you think of this jetpack trail? It's kind of interesting. I don't know if I'd have it all the time. a bit more capacity. Now I want to learn hydraulic wiring and magnetic resonators. This one I can make. This one I need salt. Frigate. Why didn't I get salt? How much do we actually need? One. So I need four nanotubules, 80 thing, I need 40 salt. I can't get salt from any of this stuff, can I? You don't refine this salt by chance, do you? No. I need to go get some salt. Water planet. Some other planet. planets have lots of salt on them. Is there a planet type that's good for salt? It's not usually something I go farming for. Water planets. Underwater has salt. Or chlorine, which will refine. Wait, this has salt. This has salt. Perfect. Let's land and find some salt. Will look green. I could fly around trying to spot it, but it's probably easy just to land and scan. Did I just fly over salt? No, it's yellow. Where is the salt mine? There's like nothing here. What the hell? Uranium. Salt. I think I'll just grab this as well, actually. A little bit of fuel for the way. Right, fueled up. Let's go grab the salt.
He had 40, wasn't it? Surely there's 40. I'm doing the wrong button. Right. We have legs. We do room. What next? Let's get my rewards. Nanites, exoshoot slots. Ugh, I should have got these before, shouldn't I? Underwater <laughs> modules. Multi-tool expansion slots. Oh, he actually gave me gamma root. Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh god, I was going ahead of myself. I was doing everything myself. Minotaur Bay. Okay, okay. Build my own Minotaur now. Right. Go to an atlas. Okay, back to an Atlas station. I have no room. What don't I want? This crap. Take one of these instead. Right, onwards to an Atlas station. Come on. Is this an Atlas station or is this the next? Why why is this? This is the wrong place, isn't it? This is wrong, isn't it? I've gone wrong. I've come. Where is it taking me now? It take me to the final phase already. Consult priest entity Nada before proceeding to the Atlas. Ah, uh, I was supposed to speak to Nada. I wasn't reading that. Ouch! Ouch! Really? Leave me alone? Let's go speak to Priest Entity Nada. Hello. You knew something, Traveller Entity. You knew many things Nada chooses not to know. With a pattern in your mind now, Nada thinks we may share. Reveal the construct. Traveller Entity wishes to know if this is life. Nada thinks. What is life, Traveller Entity? Which entity knows? Only one, and Nada will not approach its strange red convergence. But glass void abyss Atlantid. All words to fill a gap in understanding, a gap we may both approach. Take these fragments, this Atlantidium, reveal it to the old places, then we shall see. Is it the first, is it last, or is it something other? Okay. This ritual, if it reveals a mind, traveller entity, they will need a home. They will need others. Okay. What does that mean? And what do we do? 
Why is it telling me to speak there? Prayer for new mission. Right now it's telling me. Okay. Now we can go to the Atlas. Very good. What series are you talking about? The Last of Us or The Walking Dead? I watched a bit of The Walking Dead when it first came out, but I stopped watching many seasons ago. I don't really watch much TV these days. I play games instead. Only so much free time I have. Right, so why is it not showing me where the Atlas Station is? Or is it showing me where the Atlas Station is? Where is it taking me? Don't like this. It's not showing me the bloody way. This is going to the galactic core. What is it? This is not right. What's going on? Have I not got the right mission selected? All sentience echoes resonate a crimson frequency. Allow the Atlas to witness the old phase construct. When in space, follow the mission path to locate an Atlas. That's what I was doing, isn't it? I don't have current mission. I've only got expedition route. It doesn't let me. Have I got a bug? Wait, what are you? Why has it got a picture of a knowledge stone there? It's calling to me. Perhaps there's a zombie planet in Starfield. <laughs> That'd be funny. That'd be right. That'd be amazing. Oh my god. Can you imagine there's a hidden zombie planet in there? A thousand planets. This is not the right way. It says it still says consult precinct. You know that I just did that though. Did it not register it? Wait, complete the grand divergence milestone. It wants me to do this first. Current objective: follow. Nanda hopes to test the properties of Antididium. They have located a suitable Corvax monolith. This is what... This is what was marked. Okay. That doesn't... That wasn't easy to follow. Uh, why on earth are we doing it out of order now? Why has it jumped me to this one? That completely confused me for a little bit. That'd be funny as I'm planet. <laughs> I think you have to do one of the others, Divergence maybe, it's out of order. That's just weird, isn't it? If it, the whole series has been in order, and then all of a sudden they do one that's out of order. It just confuses everybody. Corvax Bitcho. Yay. Nada's ritual site. You know what would be a nice addition to these expeditions? If Hello Games took it upon themselves to build some mega base. Just for the expeditions that look stunningly. Some amazing cities. Wouldn't that be cool? God, approximate location. Who likes approximate locations? This is perplexed thousands. <laughs> right, where does it want me to go? Target aligned, straight ahead. Are we going to find a monolith? Oh my god, I'm killing myself. Ooh, butterflies. Scanners down. I wish there was a better hotkey for switching scanners. 
I find it very fiddly to switch scanners, I can't be bothered. Wait. I want to adopt you. Come here. I'm adopting you as a companion. Hello. Right, we now have creature pet. Which I will put on a hock here, number six. Oh god, you're so small. This is not going to be very fast travel, is it? Oh god, it's terrible. Oh well. <laughs> uh, beggars can't be choosers. I've got a little ladder. Little tiny moped. Right, where are we going? This way. One left. Messages. Where's the message? Monster or something. Ra ra ra. Glory to truth and freedom. Welcome, Irons. You can't change your gender. <laughs> It's been a hard journey. Stop worrying against Ukraine. I agree with that. Hello from China. Hello from Ukraine. Oh, get him out of your fire. Are you kidding me? I'm not allowed to add. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. No, I can't, but I freaking. Wait. Can I not block someone's base? I don't want to report it. Can I not just block it? No. No. Never. Right, what am I supposed to do, actually? Disorder and interfere. Oh my god. Wait, they've added a new thing. Is this going to be everywhere? I'm also doing this out of order. Does it matter? <gasps> Wait, it's new. That's cool. The ritual is complete. I hear the distant voices of the Korvax entities who once worshipped here. And yet there is another voice, discordant, unmistakable, growing ever louder. As it resonates, words written in my own language grow faintly on the monument. What is a shell but a vessel? Of silicon, glass or metal, a crystal, a planet. They awaken from the void. They all awaken in response. In unison against deletion. Oh God. The voice of Atlantid. She will see us, her children. Echo Seed. Okay. Now we need to go to Atlas. Hey, Skip. Now I'm ahead of your own experience. This is all new to you too. Yes, I'm grinding it all out in one playthrough. I wonder if that... If all monoliths are going to have that little interface now. Or if that's just one special one they've put in. Right. We need to go to another Atlas station. Hopefully it works this time. Yes. Right.
May your seed echo through the expedition. Uh, okay. <laughs> Uh. Kind of rich. Got explorer music going on in the background. Very good. This feels very Star Trek here. Nada believes the simulation offers insight into the construct. They pin their hopes on faint traces of manufactured minds echoing around an artificial reality. Nada, divergent Nada. Nada standing alone. Nada will say they awoke with the destruction of Korvac's prime. Nada will say they are happy in their small convergence aboard the anomaly. Nada will condemn the Atlas falsity, a heretic among the Korvacs. Nada will plant echo seeds for their stimulation. The Atlas will have me forge seeds of their own. I'm so confused. It is all the same cycle. Seed of life. A seed of creation, a tiny drop of the affinity of the Atlas. Though may a misspec, the seed contains the potential for an entire universe of boundless, glorious expansion. I need five magnetized fight, of which I have none. Brilliant. Magnetized ferret. I'm just making them go back and forth from one to the other. Give me five. We have a seed of life. Forge the fourth seed. Right, let me get my reward. Three Gravitino balls. Brilliant. Just what I always wanted, Gravitino balls. What else? See, like runaway malt. I don't know what I wanted more. Gravitino balls or runaway malt? Or living pearls? I mean, things can't get more exciting. These rewards are joyous. I always wanted some runaway mold. What else? Divergence cube. Now that sounds a bit more interesting. What the hell is a divergence cube? <laughs> a divergence cube, eh? Interesting. Bring the echo seed to priest Antinada in space, summon the space anomaly. Okay. Right. How far, how much have we got left to do? Two hidden ones. And then we're already in the final phase. It's not bad. Keep the cube, let like the construct parts. We have them all here. All lined up, ready to go. Right, let's go speak to Nada. <laughs> was it first travel entity? Was it last? Was it other? Reveal the Echo Seed. All entities deserve their convergence, travel entity. 
Bovax, Construct, Nada, Traveller, Glass. Minds seek minds. Many do not see it, but Nada sees it. Sees the pattern stretch across all realities. Nada ponders the Echo Seed, this fragile receptacle, the fragment of a mind lost to time. Our home is a lifeboat, Traveller entity. Nada will welcome one more. Take these things, construct and seed to follow. They will know what to do. Okay. Follow. Advise me. You've been busy, traveller friend. You have made your own construct, friend. Ah, but they are pieces. Well, that is no problem. I have built with far worse. Fine pieces will make a fine new friend, yes? Share construct schematics. Follow scans the plans I acquired for the construct. They turn the pieces over in their hands and in their mind. The Gek appears lost in thought. They will need a little time to assemble the construct, the Echo Seed's new home. I should return later. Ten minutes. Are you kidding me? There's a time lock? Select other milestones. Okay. I guess I have to go to final phase. Complete the final pilgrimage. Optional milestones? We what? Optional milestones. Also, I might have more suit slots. I might as well take those. Let us go. In the French voice, ten minutes later. <laughs> yes, if only. All oh, the music's been on point tonight. My epic space traveling playlist. Right. Reach the final rendezvous point. We're almost there. It's the wrong one. It's the place I already visited. Of course it is. Why did it just take me out of warp? Final rendezvous. Have they found us a nice earthen paradise lush? No, they found us a Zeno colony. Wait, what? Remove the structure. So this is supposed to be some hidden code message, is it? I wonder how people solve this. They don't really give you many clues. So I could buy this base. Maybe it's near where we're supposed to go. Three resources. 
kind of don't need any resources. Alright, let's see where we have to go. I guess it's going to take us to one of those mini outposts again. Fifteen hundred U in this direction. It's a good job we have transport. Yes, run. Speed away. Oh God, it's so slow. Like really? Is this a, is this the pace we're gonna get? Suit creature is heavy. He just called me fat. The bug called me fat. Target is aligned. It's struggling. It's struggling with my weight, apparently. This is as fast as it goes. Speedy Gonzalez. Wait, I need my sh oh, I need my ship. Wait, can I use this? Oh god, I can't use my visor. Oh, that's so annoying. Is it this direction? I need to orientate myself. Thousand U, that direction. This is gonna be awkward. Hey Pete, how you doing buddy? I'm just doing the expedition. We're having quite a lot of fun. I was trying to use my bug bet to fly where we need to go, but it was rather slow. Let's have a quick look. God, we've hardly moved. Is it still straight? Now this direction. We're traveling, I guess. How are we doing? We're going the right way. Easy expedition for the new Apple users. Wait, what? In what way is it easy for Apple users? Has anyone really played this on Apple actually? I don't actually have an Apple Mac. Right, we found where we need to go. Boop. Very good. Where is my autophage? I cannot help but feel the autophage is staring at me. Its unseeing eye blindly absorbing all that comes before it. Rube damage registers. Five. 11, 16. Five, 11, 16. The sharp scent of ozone fills the air around me as a thousand smokeless fires ignite within the autophage's core. Ouch. They think that we have forgotten. They think we are forgotten. She has found us. We have remembered. We... The final schematic. My construct's completion is on the horizon, and yet I pause. Who has forgotten? Who has remembered? Atlantid Reactor. Oh, sh shoot. I used up my crystallized heart. Damn it. I knew I shouldn't have done that. 
Now that is annoying. I'm also out of robot. It is also annoying. Hmm. Right, I'm gonna have to go murder, murder stuff. I don't really need any of this stuff, do I? Or bolt. I'm literally out of cobalt. I need a cave. And I need to murder some quads. I need to find... the dudes and start murdering them. Do you see the dudes marked on the map? I think you do, don't you? I never play with the HUD. I don't see any. I guess I'm going to have to fly around and look for dudes. How annoying that I spent my heart. That is... <laughs> it's just typical, isn't it? I can't get it back, can I? No. Right, so I want to find a dude. Come on, dudes. Where you at? I don't actually have room on this ship if I start shooting them. Move this to the suit. There's a dude. There's a quad. Oh god, land. Did I kill the right guy? I didn't get a heart, did I? Where the hell is it? I'm sure I saw a quad then, didn't I? Where's the quad? Is it you? Did I really not get the... I did. I got the crystallized heart. I did get the crystallized heart. Ouch. Right, what, what else do I need? I need a cave. In the cave and some cobalt. Or I could go to a space station and just buy the stuff. It's probably easier, isn't it? I need to lose the heat. Can I find a cave before I lose the heat? I see a cave. I need my gravitino storm back. You're flying around on that planet and the worm popped up and hit your ship. Well, that's pretty cool. Did you manage to get a picture? I love to make pictures of funky moments like that. This is not a cave. I need cobalt, damn it. Is there a cave within this? Please have a cave. This is a non cave cave. Maybe a cave? This looks promising. Come on, there's going to be cobalt in here somewhere. Gold bolt. Right. 
make some ionized cobalt. What else are we missing? Antimatter housing. Really, I can make that. There's a sandworm you were talking about. I missed it. Don't know where it's gone. At Alexi Chick, a little quirk in phase five. Do gravity diversions before prayer? Yes, we we managed to find that out eventually. It did trick me for a little bit. It got me all confused. Right. Uh, no, that's not the right one. What am I doing? You need the ionized cobalt. We have it a reactor. You've done it. Wait, I still have heat on me. Do I still have heat? We need an emergency escape. At speed. Please. Run. Let's go. Let's go. They're, they're, they're shooting at me. They'll never catch me. Look, they're baiting. They're scared of my bug. Uh, run! Fly! <laughs> this is the slowest bug ever. I've never had such a slow bug. Accelerate. Have I got the bug where combat doesn't disappear, by the way? Speedy Bug Gonzalez. Use the cloaking device. Good idea. This is just a regular bug. A regular bug with nobody's flying on it. Oh god, I'm detected. Try again. Detected. Try again. Detected. Try again. I don't have enough charge. My bug is bugged. Invisible for a long time. Go at speed with the bug. Weave. Weave. Oh, God, I'm still detected. Okay. Bug is useless. Can I summon my glorious minotaur and away we go I see two dudes <gasps> two dudes will have protection change direction how are we still under attack corrupt swarm abating apparently why am I still two star? Let me visible. Surely. Swarm is hunting. How am I instantly detected? Like, there's nothing here. What is going on? Is this the bug? I have the detection bug. Uh, swarm is baiting. Instantly detected. Uh, do I have to reload? I hate reloading. I'm miles away. Wait, go into water. They always disappear when you're under water, don't they? not disappearing. Reload it is. I'll just reload. It's 
a weird bug there, isn't it? We do get it occasionally. Right. Back to Specialist Bolo at the Anomaly. I would say let's have a look at this sandworm, but I cannot see a thing. Away we go. Let's see what Polo has to say. I miss out on a reward, by the way. I did lots of rewards. Bear kits. What else? Expansion slots. Don't even need all these expansion slots. I have been busy too, traveller friend, but now it is done. You will want to visit them, yes? Do not be shy, traveller friend. Go see our new friend. Okay. Polo has assembled the construct components into an automation rehome the echo seed within the construct. The lifeboat. What am I supposed to do? I'm kind of confused. Lifeboat. Visit the assembled construct. Visit the construct aboard the space anomaly. It's supposed to be on the space anomaly. It's over there. Gay. Let's have a look. The assembled construct. Why, hello. 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 Oh, my goodness me. Look freaky. Construct boot process. Minor simulation branch idle. Vessel awaiting input. Plant echo seed. Registering sentience echo to locate carapace. Scanning. Uh, okay. Echo lock secured. Objection event detected. Carapace stabilized. Installation process will seed control to local thread. Lost, 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 lost. Where, where, who, who shall lost? Others. The symbol construct repeats the same few words in an endless loop. I cannot tell if this is pain, confusion, surprise, or just the random echoes of a much decayed data packet. Now will know. Okay. Looks a bit distressed. Completed the lifeboat. Rebirth is challenging, traveller entity, but do not worry. The Echo Construct will adjust to its new shell given time. We will help them. Traveller entity, they are lonely. Now they can feel it. They do not feel at home on our anomaly. There will be others, traveller entity. 
Atlantidium spills from the earth. Echoes call out to be saved. There must be others. Bolo will save them for Nada, and Nada will help them live. Okay. My reward. The lifeboat. Wait, this is still phase four. Oh yes, because we had to go back, didn't we? Stasis device. Rusted metal. Wow. A stasis device, eh? They want me to be rich. I better not sell it. I'm going to need this for something, aren't I? Wouldn't it be bad if I got rid of it and then we need it for something? <laughs> oh dear. Craft yourself a stasis device. Brilliant. Right, what next? Locate another echo. Crown objective. Speak to Nada and Bolo. Speak with Bolo. Where is Bolo? There's Bolo. Nada hopes to save more Echo friends. They have always been ever so generous, Traveller friend, and so now you and I will help, dear Nada. Take this and go where I cannot. You will find more, many more Echoes, I think. Except schematic. So many lost seeds, so many new friends for our little home. Are we going to get procedural robots? Maybe. A resonance amplifier, an attachment for the multi-tool scanner designed by specialist Bolo for the detection of antlidium infused sentient echoes. On dissonant worlds, use the analysis visor to locate sentient echoes on arrival at any echo site. Use C to fully reveal the mountain and amount is interesting. Okay. I will build one of those. Locate an Echo Seed on a Dissonant World. Let's go find ourselves. Wait, are we going to be able to find little robot pets on Dissonant Worlds, maybe? With a scanner? That'd be pretty fun. This is a dissonant world. Let us try. Scan for echoes on dissonant planet and when you arrive at the scan location, press the... I don't see what it's written. It's blocked on my screen. Something key to make them pop and then mine them. We'll work it out. Target sweep. Locate an echo seed. Nearest sentient echo located. 500 you away. Four hundred you away. Send an echo, it looks like this. Almost looks like a radiant shard, doesn't it? We've got new objects on dissonant worlds. Is this in the actual game now then? Sentience echoes. Nearest echo located. At the echo site, deploy the deploy the resonance with C. Oh, echo seed. Bring the echo seed to Nada. Is it coincidence that we get a gravity in a storm as soon as I 
mine it. Echo seed. The seed is an echo of life, the last reverberations of a living being. The seed was revealed in a vision granted by Nada's ritual at a monolith infused with Antlantidium. Very good. Right. Let's hand this in. So what are these going to be then? Is this something more for like for the base game or is it something just for the expedition? Nada welcomes all lost entities to our small convergence and Polo's echo construct is a fine vessel. But all these echoes, it may be a challenge. We should consider another way to home them. Nada pulls it, they're clearly torn. There is another way. Nada will plant your seed in a sacred place. The prime terminal is a relic of Nada's former self, a safe refuge, a home for echoes. The seed may blossom, or it may not. It will need others. We shall try. Okay. It is right to try, Traveller Entity may plant the seed. Plant the echo seed at Nada's prime terminal. Its simulation may allow the seed to blossom. Where is her terminal? Over there. Terminal Prime. We have a new terminal. Wait, can I get in here? This is new. Oh, they've got a new area. Wait, this wasn't here before, was it? Terminal Prime. Secondary simulation right enabled. Collective network sentience threshold 100%. Personal contributions 0 souls. Prepare. Upload echo seed or retrieve echo collective. What is this one? Echo collective. A shifting vortex of antlitidium attuned to the growing collective will house inside Nana's, Nana's prime terminal. Current threshold question mark question mark. The green oscillates in a pattern, but the message is unintelligible. What the hell? A shifting vortex of at Atlantidium attuned to the growing collective will house inside Nana's prime terminal. Current sentience threshold 100%. The grains oscillate in a pattern, repeating a strange message. Are we supposed to decode this strange message? Upload the seed. Secondary simulation right enabled. Collective network sentience threshold 100%. Personal contribution one soul. Okay. Milestone lost souls. Rescued another echo. Let me just. Wait, what is this? Collect reward. Supreme scanning system upgrade emergency signal scanner. Okay. Don't think we even have room. Put that in. What else did we get? Right, that's all of these. And this we get current objective face will complete. We fair as helm. We do what? 
Wayfarer's Helm, an exclusive exosuit appearance override. Despite its aerodynamic appearance and advanced solar design, reliance on helmet exclusive propulsion is not advised. Maximum safety ensure all body parts are propelled equally. Transform the appearance of the exosuit and an appearance modifier. Let's go have a look, shall we? Appearance modifier. The Wayfarer's Helm. This is the Artemis Quest location. Ah, uh, I don't... Have I ever been there? I must have been... No, I've never been there. I don't think I've ever been in that room. Right, we want... Uh, what is this? Do you have to be an anomaly, maybe? Wayfarer's Helm. It looks like a toaster. I still look pretty cool. There we go. There's the Wayfarer's Helm. I never quite understand why they can't let you have the helms on whatever race you want to play. I could have this on a Corvax or a Gek or whatever. Why does it force me to be an anomaly? Right, what else? Tier 5 is complete. Overall communicate progress is 100%. Next collective sentience threshold is 0%. Nanda believes the key to understanding the construct in Lord Faye lies within their collective data. With enough of these sentience echoes, the prime terminal may be able to stimulate the network intelligence required to ignite life within the construct. So it's like in a community event to complete this, but we've done it. So what do I need to do? Next collective sentence, I should do 0%. Locate an echo seat. He wants me to go get another one. Okay. Am I doing this right? What's the after this? Commune with the Atlas. Can I even do this? I guess let's do this Echo Seed first again. It's a bit strange it's making you do the same thing again. Tier 5 is completed by the players, but you also have to contribute. Fair enough. We'll contribute. I wonder how many players they had playing the expedition. Be nice if they released numbers like that on occasion. Just so you get a feel for how many people are actually playing. Uh, how do I search for this thing? Press F to locate. I'm pressing F. Am I supposed to see it already? Yes. Right. 
Let's go get ourselves. Is it really three minutes away? No. You can then hand in ten at a dime, just grab loads. But really? But it says it's already like full. Wait, what? Leave me alone, you bastard. I'm trying to get a sentient echo. Do I really have to kill this thing? Where's the little shit? You bastards. More? Any more? So many of them. God, I'm taking loads of damage. I'm going to die in freaking normal mode. Whew. These places are rough. In my shield's back. Can I have a shield back, please? Before something murks me. Why does it feel like I'm being chased? Shields recharge, please. One time. Boom subsiding. <laughs> I got scared in normal mode. By frigging aliens. I've lost my thing, haven't I? Where the hell has it gone? Whoa. Radiant Shard. That's the one, isn't it? Are they always next to these? Oh my god! Do they only spawn on vile planets? Do you an Echo Seed? Wait, there's two. Leave me alone. No AI on mech. Well, it's just a new mech that we've got from the, the expedition, so it doesn't have any upgrades in. Right, what am I doing? Do you reckon I do need to get more, or can we just take these two in? I'll try taking the two in. Is it always said it's full? Right. Go to the prime terminal. Let's try and put these seeds away.
Did I just go the wrong way? I just went the wrong way. Can you do more than one at a time? You can do one. Sendian Zeko achieved. Okay. Let's have a look. Elect reward. All wax words. Resent the Atlantic. Oh, God. I missed what it was saying. Right. So we now need to go to Atlas Station. And present the reactor. Onwards. it. Let's see what the Atlas has to tell us this time. Atlas word for you. The Atlas created is set in motion an infinity ago. It does not speak to me. To now. How could it? The construct? Is this a message from the Atlas? Am I the tool? A mere messenger? Or am I the recipient of the message? <laughs> if the Atlas has a message for me, it lies beyond my comprehension. It lies beyond. Perhaps there's no message. Perhaps the Atlas cannot and will never speak. Perhaps there is only what I wish for the Atlas to say. Seed of hope. Seed of creation. A perfect droplet of infinity. A gift from the Atlas. This is a tiny fragment of all the universe's dreams, will, power and life. Fragment of the Travellers, a fragment of myself. Use E to resonate the seed, converting its waveform into the audible range. Let us make the seed. I do this E, and it doesn't actually seem to ever make any sound. Maybe it's because I've got music turned off. Hmm. Okay, Mihal, all the best. Become the droid. <laughs> Breathe life into the construct. Complete either ignition, Atlantid, or ignition, Crimson. Become the droid, eh? reward sorted glitches Ooh. 
Mortal Glyph set. Restore life to the construct. Breathe in life. Are you kidding me? I need multiple crystallized hearts. No, that's the reward. Okay. How do we do this? Complete the construct by using the Atlantid Reactor or the Seed of Hope. Am I supposed to do this at the... Anomaly? Where am I supposed to go? Is it supposed to be in the Atlas? The choice here is irreversible and only one option may be chosen. Was it supposed to still be on the in the atlas? I just misunderstood. So what are we supposed to choose and how do we know? It landed or crimson. It landed. Surely it landed. I said it landed. Good or evil? Which one's good? Which one's evil? Should we choose? I wonder what the mass majority of players choose. It's not obvious. I should tell you to speak to the Atlas or something. It's, it's, it's not very obvious as what you're supposed to do exactly, is it? There's a trick to getting both options. Wow. Well, I'll stick with one for now. I can't even speak with this thing. What am I supposed to do? It's not letting me interact with it. Breathe life into the construct. I'm so... Construct is on the anomaly. Oh, that thing. Okay, I get it now. I got confused. I thought you were telling me to go back to the Atlas, but you were telling me to go to the anomaly. Okay, I understand. I get it. I thought I was going to have to interact with the Atlas again to make my decision. Back to the anomaly it is then. Which ending did you choose? Right, let's go speak to the construct then. With a seed of hope. You did two playthroughs, oh wow. The construct is highly distressed. I will need to earn the trust 
or at the very least calm whatever electric storm currently rages within their carapace. Shell lost, where shell, shell lost, others, who, who lost, where others lost, 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 where others, who others, soothe. The Echo Collective has an immediate effect on the assembled construct. They seem reassured by the presence of the other's Echo Seeds. Shell. Here. Lost. Others there. Others. Others here. Lost. Others. Shell. Shell here. Available. Accepted. The assembled construct is its own entity, distinct from the remnants I have found strewn across planets, distinct from the growing collective within Nada's stimulation. They've become more than an Echo. I cannot tear them from their shell once more. And yet, there is a piece missing. They are incomplete. The shell shapes them, but does not define them. There must be a spark. Wait. Connect Atlantid Reactor or Plant Seed of Hope. I play through twice before seeing the reload trick. If you make a restore point, before making them a choice, you can reload and do it again with the other choice. Do I need to do that? I mean, I guess the game intends me to just make one choice. That only took about three hours the second time through. What is the seed of hope? Am I corrupting it with a seed of hope? Or is that a good thing? Seed of creation, a perfect droplet of infinity, a gift from the Atlas. Corrupted the gift from the Atlas. Do we trust the Atlas or do we not trust the Atlas? I always view the Atlas as not trustworthy. Let's not trust the Atlas. We will do this one. I acquired the Atlantid reactor from the same source as the rest of the construct schematics. It seems fitting to complete their assembly within this final piece. And yet, is this the right decision? Once they've been connected, there will be no going back. Their shell and their echo will be fused and final. Hmm. Choices, choices. We do it. X assembled construct. Core protocol aligned. Atlanted. Ear shell completed. Intact. Finished. Whole. Reawakened. Language synthesis. Partially stabilized. Complete the construct. This shell thanks you, shell. Other entity. Here shell is accepted. This echo is home. Milestone complete, ignition Atlantid. Choose a mechanical mind. Breathe life into the construct. Okay. Speak to Nada and Polo. Get my reward. Crystallite hearts, just what I always wanted. What else? Optional milestone. Ah, that's why there's another one. I see. Wait, so there's a different head that you get. Ah. Atlantid. Wait, so what did we actually get? Construct head. It's a head for the construct. That's the construct. Okay. Collect my rewards. Banner. The construct singularity decal plans. So can I build this thing or not? Permadeath King the construct. Earned for expedition accomplishments. 
Okay. I speak with Nether and Pelo. Welcome home, traveler entity. Nothing has changed. Everything is the same. Nether does not joke. Polo is always being busy. Little improvements there. Optimizing, enhancing. With all the time we have, Polo Entity can fix many things. Okay. Are these guys even... Wait. New reward. What does this mean? Reward the Construct Customization Set. So how do we actually use this construct? Am I supposed to do anything else or are we done? And you can outfit yourself as a construct. Okay. Let's have a look. Will it be under this one? Construct head. Oh my god. Why does it come under the anomaly? So it's basically an appearance mod. Now I kind of want to know what the other one looks like. Damn it. Well, hello. I look rather funky. Hey, Stephen, how are you doing? You can change every part of your body. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Body shape. Also. Woohoo! Wow. Oh, yes. No, 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 go away. How do I get rid of that? There we go. Construct backpack. Debo jet. Why look at me? I'm glorious. I'm a robot being. It seems I've completed it. Well done, this one was interesting. Yes, I look quite, quite the guy, don't I? Tell you what, let us go visit somebody's base and pose. Now I'm kind of curious what the other one looks like. I don't actually know. Which one looks better? Does this guy look better or does the other one look better? What does the seed of hope outfit look like. Robo Alexi check, yes. 
12 Towers Castle Refueling Station Perfect Perk Coffee. Let's go have some coffee. Nice way to finish up the expedition. That was not a bad expedition. It felt fairly short. I mean, I've managed to do it all in one stream. Pretty good. A few minor hiccups along the way. Right, Sparkle Rain's base. Now, this looks rather epic. Very nice color scheme. There's some music going off. This looks very colourful. I don't even know how you do these colours like this. What a base! Oops. This looks very nice. Interesting he's using this as lighting. It's really cool actually. Crackling fire. I'll sit down by the fire. I might switch just to less for a little bit. Not bad, is it? Looks good with those wings, it does, doesn't it? Be nice if they folded down, yeah. Am I going to do it again for the other head? I don't know. I might do. I don't actually know what the other head is. Better get some coffee if I need to stay up all night. I know. I know. I'm going to go have a break. Watch something. Then go grind a bit of Diablo. And then go to bed. And die. <laughs> That's it. Just trash the place. <laughs> Very nice little base, isn't it? What is this step, and why is it broken? Very cool bass, very nice. I've never done this music stuff here. Right, anyway, I hope you've enjoyed my little expedition playthrough. I'm going to have to look up what the other head looks like now. I'm curious. Did I make a good choice or a bad choice? I mean, he looks pretty cool. Right. Anyway, I'll have a... I'll see you guys next time, I guess. Probably back with a bit more Diablo next time, because that's the game I'm kind of grinding away at at the moment. But for now, I'll see you guys next time. <laughs> right, have a good one everybody. See you guys later. Good luck Coop, getting to T3. I tried to knock on the door of T4, but I'm not quite ready yet. No worries, Stephen. I'll see you next time.